Yo, 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 man, we back, man. Hell yeah, another hey. day. Hey, uh, this is this is like the fourth week without Dijon, man. That's cap. Hey, hey, what four the weeks fuck is, is crazy. Dijon at? Four but we weeks don't know. Is excessive, you cap. Fine Third week, week, right? Finding Nemo. Yeah. No, I like to say Dijon at Remo. He was only there last week, no? Oh, no, he wasn't. How many Monday shows we did without that, that nigga? No, that? bro. It's been three we Monday didn't do shows. No three Monday shows. Yes, yes, yes. No, bro. no, y'all playing. He's cap. Where, where the fuck did y'all really at, gang? Yeah. That's where you at? I'm God? Bro, we don't know, bro. Don't know, that's, bro. That's, 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 but the, hey, listen, so it look. It feel like it was that many. I just thought it was yeah. the Munchie and Spider local. He called in all the way. Because he ain't that's sick. That's a fact. Yeah. He ain't, it ain't here. That nigga I don't ain't know, sick. Bro. Yeah, man. So listen, so I did talk to him and he told me that he will be back soon. You feel me? Now listen. I think it's like the treadmill, man. You feel me, right? Yo, listen, right? So look. <laughs> so he worked out for the first time in, I think, like 10 years and on stream. Man, stop playing. No, he dead did. ass. First time in 10 the years, nigga, bro. And That's on stream, said. and then he Where did. the fuck is the The nigga came at? with a little stationary bike, yeah. nigga, and was sweating on the And that was his hour. last day. <laughs> and nah, we ain't seen that nigga since. Bro, I'm dead That's ass, bro. I he smell, not lying. I That's smell capping him. The nigga brought a stationary bike. He brought a stationary bike. I feel like y'all know where he at, y'all ain't saying nothing. Nah, no, bro. I'm telling you, bro. I smell cap. He brought a stationary bike, nigga, was in this bitch drenched in sweat, and yeah. we ain't seen that nigga since. since. So oh, I don't know, bro, if it's working out. Wait, so, got so, 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 y'all saying y'all don't know why he ain't been here? Know. There he go. say he's finna get there the Batman yeah, Kevlar. There go. Huh? It's right there. Hey, he hey, say he getting the Batman Kevlar. Hey, they right cap, there, they man, capping bro. in here, y'all. I, I just God. talked to Dijon. He came in. I just talked to Dijon like 30 minutes ago. They capping. Hey, I ain't seen that nigga. Yeah, man. They capping in this room. Let's get it. Let's call him real quick, man. Let's move on. You probably know more than us, nigga. You talked to him 30 minutes ago, nigga. You know. Wait, wait, wait. I ain't talked to his ass 30 minutes ago, nigga. Niggas know what's up. But let's call him real quick, man. That's crazy. He know more than both of you. Hey, I don't know shit. I just know y'all capping. Hey, that's the truth, nigga. I, I, I wasn't even here. I was at the crib watching him sweat on the thing. You feel me? And that was the last Wait. time we seen that nigga. If the Jean go pick up, probably not. If I'm like, he, he probably Hollywood like, now, man. He ain't picking up. Man, he probably like, bro, like you niggas, bro. I ain't trying to talk to you he niggas. He got too no much more. fly shit going on. Huh? He got too much fly shit going on. Yo, Dijon. What's up, man? You listen, man. So first off, we live now. This is crazy. Man. Now listen, Wally was like, bro, where is the Jean at, man? Feel me? Look, man. Man, what's up, Wally? Hey, Dijon. What's good, brother? Man, I'm up here trying to figure out where you at. They talking about you You, you got on a treadmill and couldn't make it or something. Like, you was too tired from working out or something. I said, I smell cap. Nah, yo, it's true, man. Listen, we ain't seen them. Listen, we ain't seen them since. It's not true. I did not work the treadmill. I don't even get on treadmill. Stop playing with me. Nah. Stationary bike. Yeah, bike. You feel me? Right, listen. I got on that bike in front of you, Flacco. I don't like the bike shit. Stop with the bike shit. <laughs> no facts. Not, right? So look, right? So look. Yo, listen, man. We miss you, Dijon. Feel me, man? Right? Now listen. Right. right, listen, man. The fans are asking where. Where is Dijon? Wally asking where is Dijon, man? Feel me, man? But listen, I'm not going to ask you for your timetable. Right? But, but though. But it ain't got nothing to do with a bike. Lead an exercise bike out of it. Facts. I told you they was capping. Hey, that's the last time we seen that nigga. <laughs> have you used my exercise bike? If I get on that bike yeah. and that bike feel any differently, Flacco, have you been up there using my exercise bike? I have not, but I should, right? Possibly get your own bike. I don't want somebody else using my Possibly exercise get bike. Why? <laughs> why? 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 Like, why? Like, our personal exercise bike. My exercise bike. What grade did you get? Our wallet? bus, like, can't share, like, the same seat? Like, what's going on? <laughs> No, hey, what grade did John give you? Huh? What grade did John give you? Oh, yeah, John. Wait, pause. So what grade did, did you give Wally? Because I think we had, like, a disagreement on a, and on a grade. You gave me a B minus. You know what? You That's gotta hard for DeJong. Sure That's a fact. A That's oh, B minus. Yeah, but I think he gave me a B yeah, minus. DeJong, why that. did you give Wally a B minus, man? For me, Because, like, bro, like, listen, he does it all and he's consistent. He doesn't drop projects on projects. He puts out a, a songs though. Here, but he doesn't drop projects on projects to be that's, in that team. That's 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 what bro be looking for. You know what I'm saying? He entitled to or, his opinion. But the Wally though, wait though, right? But though, you have the best project out right now, but it's on SoundCloud. Like, why is it not on like the like DSPs? Um, I just dropped that for the fans when I was still in my deal. I couldn't mm. drop a project, so I just gave it away. 
That's crazy, man. Well, hey, listen, man. Deshaun, listen, brother. We hey, will see you soon. Hold on. I have been dropping a single every two weeks, though. Facts. With he a visual. With a visual. But the court call came out in January. While you already know I'm rocking with him, he's one of the best out right now. The best out. For his next project. But make sure you take that price tag off the bottom of your hat. Damn, bro. How you gonna call me out for being poor, man? That's crazy, bro. Being poor is crazy. We know you can. That's crazy, man. Listen, $60, man, for this hat, man. Come on, man. You paid for it. AD gave it to you. AD paid for it, but still. Exactly. Wait, wait, wait. I need some of them. AD got hats. Bro, bro. AD got like a thousand hats. He'd have had man. Hey, peace out to John. He'd have had man for sure. Bro, listen, you, AD I'm has like wild. A tag on a hat another nigga bought you is crazy. What? <laughs> like, what? And they claiming it like you just paid for he it. Nuts. Well, what you mean, Tell bro? Me, bro listen, man. Crazy. Hey, yo, yo, here, man. Right? So, so look, man. So look question, man. So one, I just opened up like my damn email, and the first thing I seen was look. Damn homie leaked. You welcome. I said, what the fuck? Nigga, why y'all sending me damn homie leaks? Man, because it's you. Fuck you, me. Wait, Make damn homie leak. sent you that leak? Or no, no, no somebody saying this. Damn homie leak. leaks and okay. said, like, you welcome. No worries. You got now, only fans leak? Know you. Come on, bro. Nigga, know you. You know. Report shit. What That's kind of you. leak is it? Let's watch it right quick. No, like, you no, feel like, me? Uh, Let's watch it right quick. Hey, it's only fan leaks. Oh, I don't want to see that. I thought it was like a leak. I thought we were finna see something crazy, nigga. I don't want to see her only So fans are emailing you damn homies only fan leaks. Look. It's Rob like no C. jumper real drama shit, nigga. If you don't yeah. watch this shit, you wouldn't know. Yeah, man. No, but the I. Right. So first off, man. So how was your weekend, man? Shit was cool, chilling. Shit, my weekend was good. I've been working in the studio. The hoes got fucked too. This New shit on the way. The hoes gonna stay getting fucked. Huh? The hoes got fucked too. Is this? Part I'm just asking. The hoes gonna stay getting <laughs> fucked. <laughs> what? Not, what? Listen, <laughs> bro. Listen, bro. I need some help, classic, man. Feel me, bro? Nah, he he, he be wilding. A grade A at. <laughs> the hoes got <go> fucked too. <laughs> what? I fucking love this. Song. Right? <laughs> right. Listen. What hey. Are you talking about. Hold. Listen. The hoes got fucked at his crib. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> our cribs ain't no hoes get fucked at our cribs. You feel me? Speak for nah. yourself. <laughs> <laughs> man, can we come man, man, not that man, shit. Come on. Get up. <laughs> nigga, get please. Up. <laughs> nigga, Speak please. Man. Yeah. Yeah. Nigga. Yeah. Nick, hey, suspect you. Yeah, listen, listen, you. Oh I've seen your. Listen, I've seen like your girl. You feel me? Right? You got a girl? I don't know what the fuck you talking. He just glazing in here. He ain't even seen your girl. He seen, I, me, I've seen, with, he seen me with bitches he with a, a badge on them. You feel me? I don't know what you talking we about. We went to a party this weekend. Me and suspect Adam. That's a yo, and that's yo, bro. This nigga, bro, Wally, bro. This niggas like, like, bro. That's so far, bro. That they go out and I don't never get like invited. But the flock of when we send you invites, you, you don't, don't never come. go nowhere. Bro, these niggas went to a party and ain't, ain't, ain't invite me like Where's at you all. Coming? <laughs> Where's you coming? Yeah, of Damn course. Fuck with you outside of no jumper. He's huh? I've seen no, no, go outside of no jumper once, twice ever. He's cap. He don't I go didn't nowhere. See, I didn't run into this nigga. Yeah, my we're f- at. Bro, I'm almost outside. A restaurant. Not Not last time on uh, Melrose. Bro, at man, the no the jumper store? store. I'm always outside, bro. You that don't know count. that. Bro. I don't fucking count. Nah, that's nah, that's work. I was at that store shit. Yeah, next but door. he was at the no jumper store. No, what, man. What is, what is that? What, I was walking what, what right next, next door. door. Right I know, next but what are they doing there? So clothes, clothes, clothes freestyles, podcasts up there. Yeah. Oh, all okay. kind of shit. Yeah, yeah, man. Cap, he don't be nowhere but that damn store right here in this house. No, well, no. Listen, I'll be outside. He be traveling and shit, but he don't be outside here. Yeah, you travel your ass off. Look, sure, for sure. Look, here, right. So look, no, look. So a dude actually like came from Chicago, right, to L.A., right, and the first thing that and he did was and he dropped like my Glendale like townhome, right? You feel me, right? And said, "Oh, yo, I got your address. I'm I'm pulling up." Now I don't know if people think it's like cause like l- 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 listen, I was pussy. This new information, I didn't know this. Yeah, right. Sixteen shot him. Ah, that's crazy. Right, right? you're a wild man. L- listen, shouting niggas out is crazy. Look. Look, I was if a punk. If gonna talk about it, fuck <laughs> it. Of course, let's do it, man. Feel me? Messy ass place up here, bro. Yeah, right. Feel me? He brought it up himself. Continue, nigga. Keep going. No, feel me? Right, no, bro. So he was, bro, he was like threatening to pull up for it. Like, talking about like, uh, oh, like a gun ain't going to save you. A nigga stretch you. All type of shit, right? For, uh, again, I got to, listen. And he did me and on Vanish Mobile, I got the screenshots. <laughs> 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 you, you, you feel me? Hey, nigga, you go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> I, I knew that, that shit was uh, coming. Was it your real I address and how he get coming. it? Yeah, so, so uh, he got my real address. Um, how, how he got it? White pages or something? 
No, because my ID. Fargo? No, 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 no. Look, right? Mm. Look. See, look. See, smart. <laughs> now, look. Now, smart. Listen. Listen. To all the niggas with Alf, bro, let me know, bro. I got the secret for you. When you get your ID, you you never put your real address on there, right? You put like an old address, your mom, a fa- do something, right? So, all my shit is a fake address. You feel me? Right? It, it, it's like my actual studio. Mm-hmm. You feel me? So, yeah. So, like, I guess I don't know how, right? Because if you go online, my real uh-huh. address dress is in there. You got to find that out, nigga. You got to... You got a mole, nigga. Somebody dropped the low on you. Nigga found out where you And did. it was your real address too, right? Yes. Uh, but again, though. Wow, man. You feel me, right? I told him pull up, bro. I, I, I'll be outside, side, you feel me? I'll wait for you. You on that shit? And he was for like five days, but you feel me, man? You feel me? And he never pulled up. You feel me? Which again, you on man. that shit. Man, man. No, but Fly, man. Hey, that nigga Flaco right, got let me ask beef you this, out though. here in the That's street. Crazy. If 16 Flaco did. got beef out here. If 16 did pull up to your crib, you just going to have a fight with him or you just going to Or you calling the police? You calling the police after you shoot him? He said both. I will open up my door and s- 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 <laughs> come, <laughs> come, come, come. So you, you're not walking outside to catch a friendly fight oh with him? Oh my god! If you invite him to your crib, you at my house. Come, I you feel me? Like, like, listen. Nigga gotta come, come up five on. floors. But he want you one of them niggas elevator. stand come. on my property so no, you gotta do something to me. Yeah. Listen, it's crazy, sin, bro. Sin, sin, listen. It's a townhome. So just walk up. Calm. You feel me? Man, let's... Uh, again, bro, I stopped being pussy as soon as I had the right to defend myself. Feel me, right? So, but, guess what, though? But he never came, so we would never know. You feel me? You feel me, man? But... Yeah, I hear calling niggas out today. Yeah, man, right? But though, past that, though, man, feel me? Did you have any beefs? Nah, I don't, I don't, you sure, I don't, man? I don't be having. Did I? <laughs> you sure, man? It's crazy. You sure, I'm gonna be bitch. Cause, I, cause, hey, listen. This nigga is hilarious, bro. You sure you ain't bruh, got no beef? Bruh, what do you know that I don't? Remo got beef, bruh, bruh. I heard, bro, that DJ U man. Oh shit, has been pissed at this nigga, bro. Cause listen, bro, listen, bro. Cause this everybody that you interview, me. man. Hmm. D- if hey, listen, DJ U have been tight. Have been pissing. That's a Chicago nigga, right? Boy, bro, have been tight, been pissing. Feel me, man? Like, feel me, bro? Like, what you do to that nigga, Remo? And, and his cereal, man. Listen, cause <laughs> he just talking now. <laughs> oh, you what? don't know this either? He I got the audio of him talking about how, like, cause he believes that we stole his entire entire wave of like Chicago niggas, right? Feel mm. me? Right now, hey, look, look, right? So, so look, right? So look, so, right? So look. So I heard. That Big Mike was the last nigga he had left, and, and this nigga just took his life. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Hey, yo, yo, he really yo, funny yo, as fuck. Hey, look, all right, bro, this, you a cold nigga, Remo. Bro, yo, listen, you're still in podcast right, interviews. Bro, bro, Big Mike was his last in viral interview, interview that he had all to himself, bro, and you just. Took, took how the, you like, claim like, dibs on the nigga? All right, that's what I'm saying. First that's of all, great. DJ, got, you don't y'all, own these Chicago beef. niggas, y'all so like, got podcast beef. Podcast yeah, beef, it's not, bro. it's not no beef. DJ, you my homie and shit. I say this before I even that's came. What I heard, listen, man. before I came to no jumper and shit, <laughs> DJ, you been in my crib in Atlanta and shit. Like, we yeah. chopped it up and shit. I used to actually run all his shit. 2024, on like social y'all. media back in the day. So it ain't no real beef. shit. But I did see some shit where he was saying that all. He no. said that no jumper stole his whole way. And I heard recently that he was upset about, you feel me? If it was recent, I don't know. About Big Mike. No, listen, listen I heard he was he was upset about the Big Mike shit because you apparently ain't tap in. Tap in with who? Oh, with him. He was supposed to tap in, nigga. So I was supposed to tap That's in with DJ to get the Big Mike interview? Yeah, right? I mean, you better start uh, tapping in for niggas put belt to ass, Remo. I don't know about all that, but <laughs> man. I ain't tapping in with no nigga to get no interview. That's and crazy. And keep it all the way 100, Big U reached, I mean, I said Big U. Big Mike reached out to, to me to do the interview, you know what I'm saying? So you like, play Big Mike, you feel me? <laughs> but, but, <laughs> DJ, you don't own these Spider-Man. niggas, man. <laughs> but you make it seem like DJ, you own these niggas. That's like if no. he go to another platform in LA, he can go to any LA platform, like, nigga, we... We don't own any anybody for us. Dibs like, on the ground now. Yeah, we can't call dibs. Like, that's our interview right there. Like, True, that shit man. don't even sound right. But I mean, if you do got a problem with it, I mean, I don't know. I haven't heard anything recently, but I heard some shit he said like a couple months back or whatever. And I, I 
I talked to him about it, but it ain't, yeah. it ain't really been shit. It ain't no beef or nothing. Hey, man. man. News to me. But no jumper, we doing our shit. You know I'm what I'm saying? Out As out we should. Every day around this month. Man, Wally, man, what's your take, man, on podcasts turning into the new streets? That's I hate this shit. <laughs> Why? <laughs> yeah. I really hate this shit. Honestly, a lot of the shit that's the wave now, I don't really agree with. Like, like if I didn't have to get on Instagram to yeah. promote music and shit, I'd never be on none of this shit. Why? Because I don't care for none of it. Like I feel like as I feel like this shit really for the kids. Like like stardom, all that shit is for the kids. I don't care about really like being a star. Like I make music for motherfuckers like me. Mm -hmm. Like just people that need it. Listen, like, yo. So listen. So listen, right? So again, like we not from like the same like environment, right? But somehow like I relate to the shit you be saying, right? That mean I'm doing my job right. Yeah, man. Like, 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 um, hey, right. So, so hey, right. So, look, um, and there was a song called Damage, right? Where you said, yo, listen, uh, what? Let me see, bro. Oh, no. You said, um, uh, I, I just lived a whole year off of scamming. I said, nigga, bro, I feel you, man. You feel me? Yeah. <laughs> you feel me? Hey, nigga, I feel you, man. Listen, yeah. man. You feel me? Hey, listen. <laughs> Hey, nigga, teach me how to do it, man. Feel me how? You feel him, but teach me how to do it. It's Flacco, he, he know he used to be a Philly scammer. Yeah, you was scamming niggas back home? Yes, he was. was. He's still a scammer. Huh? It that, wasn't a scam, bro, right? Bro, so Philly look. is like, Philly is wild. Facts. True. Now, listen, now, right? Now, listen, fortunately for me, I never had to live as an adult. You feel me? And oh, in Philly, you feel shit. me, right? No, but, okay, right, so look, so it's not scamming, right, but I used to run these things, you know, uh, allegedly, you know, if you still need it, feel me, right, called, uh, <laughs> called, um, a streaming farm. Yeah, called like stream farms, right, we're pretty much, you feel me, right, um, I have an application on, like, my computer where it pulls up, like, 20 tasks, and they each, like, play, like, a song for, like, like, 30 to 35 seconds, and then like restart it again. So, right, so back in the day, I used to have like 20 tags and only each like computer and like 10 laptops, you feel me, right? And just run shit up, feel me, right? So like, right, so prior to this, that was like my grand hustle, you feel me, right? So like, I used to give, you feel me, like the artists and the labels plays, you feel me? Yeah, mm. I, I didn't heard about that shit. That's wild. I ain't, I, 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 ain't I ain't never did it. I got. I ain't never did it. I got all my shit organic, but I heard about it though. My niggas no. faking streams and shit. Hell yeah. Yo, hey, listen, cause hey, listen, cause 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 hey, we heard. I don't want to say the name for me, cause he gangster. <laughs> but like, we seen something outrageous, bro. You feel me? And he's an LA nigga too. Mm. Wait, no, is he bro, LA come on, give me like a good couple million on every last one of my songs. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Uh, is he Run my shit Compton? up. Who? What did the, the name start with? I don't want to say. This nigga messy, bro. Look, right? Look. <laughs> so look. So like dude had like 600,000 views and like 200 comments. I, I said, nigga, please. Right? <laughs> In like 10 hours. Huh? <laughs> I said, I be, I, be, a, I be catching that shit too, though. No, no, right. No, but like also too, right? Is and this was a dude where everybody was like, "Yo, he's a nigga out here, yo." I said, "All right, you feel me? Is he a nigga out here?" <laughs> right? I checked this shit because again, I respect the OGs. You feel me? The right? OGs, right? Oh, he a big homie. He's you know he's an older cat, right? You feel me? But I respect the OGs. But like, if I haven't heard from you or heard something that like that like resonate with us for the last like 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 uh, two years or so. Then I'm not really like checking for you, and I don't really like count you as part of like the active scene, right? But niggas like, yo, bro, he's a nigga out here. I checked the nigga like YouTube plays, bruh. Bruh. Like, I don't, hey man, listen, bro. It's looking bad out here, man. Feel me, man? But though, listen, but though, back to that, man. Feel me? Was you really living a year off of scamming, man, or you know, what was that cap, man? Nah, I done did that shit. Huh? I, it wasn't recent, but yeah, I for sure did. How? Okay, like what? Like some like like some bank scams. Fucking uh, nigga, listen, Hell no. listen. I love you, bro. You're hilarious. Hell no, not listen. no bank scams. Yeah, hey, look, Wally been rich now for years. I'm sure the statue of limitations. I'm for sure a broke nigga. Hell Please nah, do man. not 
address me as a rich nigga. Hell, I'm a what? broke nigga. Wait, how? Look. Man, look, listen, man. Fresh chucks ain't creased yet. These ain't chucks. Well, not chucks. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, like, what are those? JaVinci. Yeah. Boy, boy, listen, boy. Boy, listen, man, I'm a broke nigga, man. Nah, y'all the real I'm a broke nigga, man. Nigga. That's wow. crazy. Y'all the real. to do that broke shit, bro. Bro, I'm so broke, right, that I seen some flash shit, some JaVinci's, and, and bro, I call it Chucks. You play a broke bro <laughs> real good, nigga, because you Flacco got, got a few M's in this shit. Man, look, nah, I didn't bro. see it. Hey, what's up though? It. You gonna you gonna run all my songs up to like two million? You got the hey. farm still bracking? Yeah, hey, you run you up his YouTube. Hell oh, nah, hell damn. nah, hell nah, man. Oh damn, <laughs> hell nah, hey. Ah, so nigga trying to say you got fake streams, fuck up? Listen, that's you how, how, you think, how you think he got those subscribers so quick? You the plug, mm. you can do it with the music, you do it with the YouTube. That's allegedly, wild. right? <laughs> allegedly, right? You that's know crazy as a bitch, bro. You got the fake streams on your shit. Well, wait, bugging. Right. Listen though, no, listen though. No. But for my shit though, like my shit match up, right? Feel me? Like in terms of like the engagement, the cross platforms. Meaning again, I have a hundred on Instagram and hundred and fifty on YouTube, right? Now, if I had like, like let's say like like a hundred and fifty and on YouTube and like three hundred and on Instagram, then I right, feel me, feel me, You're right? Funny man, bro. It's Fake man, uh, here, uh, yo, yo, here, 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 let's, right? yeah. Let's talk about. Uh, oh yes, about so, so let's Adam. Nah, before we get into that, let's let's stay on the LA topic. Okay, we were uh, about maybe a month ago. Flacco had uh, a lot of LA uh, rappers and shit upset with you because you me. you made some comments and shit on here. I, f I forgot specifically what so you said. So look, so you said oh, okay, LA rappers dead. Yeah, yeah. look, no Buttle. To be fair though, I disagree with you on that one. Buttle, wait, wait, the Buttle, right? To be fair to what I did say though, when I said that comment, you can check back. I I, I said we only care about like two or three niggas, and I said Wally. Nah, you gave niggas their flowers, you, you, right? For sure. So right, so that's his way out right now. No, 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 no. Wait though, right? <laughs> Look, so so again, when I say dead, there was like a solid like nine month period, bro, where nobody was dropping nothing, right? Right? Or something, or or like shit that we care about. For me, now I'll be real, bro. For me, like. Q shit, you and Grito shit about to drop soon, feel me, right? So right now, you feel me, you know, it's getting back to it, but it was like a dry spell, bro, where like, there wasn't shit moving, feel me? But though, I always said though, the, 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 uh, like, like the dudes that like, is doing something, I always say, okay, these niggas here is doing something. But the niggas who not doing nothing, like, come on, Wally, can you yeah. say, bro, like, now I look at it like this, like yeah. I feel like the niggas with the most talent been overlooked so long and the niggas it's like a popularity contest, bro. It's like we yeah. we waiting on music from the wrong motherfuckers. Like if we start putting niggas in their right place, like you know what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. like for example, like in the NBA, mm -hmm. niggas ain't never finna have the niggas that's starting is the niggas that's supposed to be starting. Yeah. It ain't like, oh, the fans this nigga cool on Instagram, so he's starting. Mm -hmm. Like, it's, it's based on talent. Like, music is fucked up. Okay. It ain't based on talent. It's based on who the people want to see or who they who the funniest or who got the most drama going on in their life. So, uh -huh. so I feel like we ain't never had a drought. It's just the ones that's popular, the ones that we waiting on, that everybody waiting on, shit. It's they, can't, they can't produce that shit uh, how niggas want to. You gotta think too, like niggas done changed the game. Like to where it's like, all right, it's some niggas dropping a mixtape every two weeks. Mm -hmm. But that ain't like every artist is different. You feel what I'm saying? Like yeah. I feel like the substance of what I'm making is different. So so me dropping a song every day, I feel like that's stupid. Of course. Like it's like it's like weed versus crack. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, let that shit go every week. Let them niggas drop every two weeks. You know what I'm saying? I feel like what I'm what I'm making is worth something else. No facts, like, right? Worth a different type of effort. Of course. You know what I'm saying? No, true. Now, hey, right? So true. So when you seen, I guess, like the reaction, because I'll be real. So me and Greedo right now, like we, you feel me? Close now, feel me, right? Like yeah. we good, we cool. But there's some other dudes who now they are refusing. <laughs> you feel me? Again, there's some other niggas who, like, who are refusing to let it go. These niggas still want to smoke with me, man. Now, do you feel like... <clears throat> 
these niggas have the right man to one smoke with Flacco, man. Feel me? Like still, not over, again, not over your opinion, yeah. because I didn't used to agree with a lot of shit that Dijon used to say. Yeah. But the thing is, just the fact that he said. It would it would be a good outcome, like of course. like niggas getting in the gym and working harder. Even though I never agree from the jump, I agree with the outcome. Of course. So I don't feel like it's nothing to beef about. Like you know what I'm saying? Like you saying that if it didn't make niggas go harder, then shit, it shouldn't be no reaction to it. True, but also too is this though, right? Like you, one of the ones who actually work hard, has a work ethic, right, bro? Wally, yeah. bro, I like, be real, bro. Like have these niggas, bro, like bro. These niggas is cool being hood famous, bro. Yeah, nah, they ain't ten, like some niggas just ain't made the decision on what they want to do yet. Yeah, like you know what I'm saying. They ain't really in this shit. If your heart ain't in it, then you know what I'm saying. Like you can't really, you can't really be mad about certain outcomes. Like no, no, look, no, I don't really agree with that. I'll say this though. I feel like there's a lot of LA rappers right now that are actually putting in the work, of course, and grinding. So we can't just undermine them and say that they don't want it. I feel like maybe just the LA scene in general is just not the popular vote yeah. across America. I mean, it so don't got to be, up. though. Because but our, he's, making it, he's saying, like, saying like our reason, bro, you can, you can go platinum just in California. Yeah. Like, like we don't have to be Absolutely. famous across the globe. Like, we got some, like, our section is so big and so popular in itself. So, yeah. Like, we don't need the rest of the world to go viral, to go platinum, none of that. Yeah, right. I mean, you could do a whole tour. You could do 40... 40 different venues just on the West Coast. Facts, of course. Like, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, no, for sure. But some niggas' heart really ain't in it. No, like, sure, right? Producers, yeah. artists, all that shit. Like, even videographers, like, you can see now more more producers, nigga, they care more about their album. Mm -hmm. You feel what I'm saying? Than, than trying, to, trying, to, trying to work with an artist and build that chemistry. Main character. They, they more so, like, they want to be popping. They want their name being heard oh, and, like, and I ain't against that, but it's like this is a team sport. Like everybody supposed to play their part. Producers is sampling everything. Absolutely. They're not making creating nothing, no new sounds, no beats. The job of the DJs have got swept under the rug because nigga, we don't even really you don't even really need a DJ nowadays, but they really is important to what we're doing. Like as far as breaking records, getting the motherfuckers heard and how they blow up. And shit, nigga. Always. Wait, 2024. Listen, cause I'll be real though, bro. Like, in 2024 in LA, these DJs ain't breaking records, yo. Like, again, again, Power 106. I love Power 106. Those man, you gonna hear Drake all day on the motherfucking Sorry. radio. You feel me? Yeah, right? I feel like, like in 2024, man. DJs not really breaking records. The the main thing is you want your song on these playlists. I feel like playlists yeah. are breaking songs, and that's really where it's at. But I feel like there's a lot of LA artists. Maybe super label shit. How are niggas supposed to get on playlists with no plug? That's the thing. Nigga have good music, good work ethic, all that. If that's the nigga the thing. ain't got them right connections, he's not on that shit. But that's really how people are getting like broken nowadays. It's like they're getting like the labels is getting them on these playlists and shit. You go to Rap uh, Caviar right Sports now, or you go to Apple Music, A, the A list playlist right now. There's songs yeah. on there that's like, why is this song still on here? Yeah. But it's like sometimes the labels and shit. I guess payola, shit. whatever it's The machine them gonna work how it works. Yeah, but for that's sure. why we as people, we gotta really do the right shit and promote each other, put niggas in the position they supposed to be in. But it's gonna get harder and harder. This shit not gonna get no easier. No facts. It's, it, it, listen, I definitely uh, agree, right? And that's why I changed like my uh, approach to okay, let me actually try to help now, right? But if I'm saying, yo, I'm gonna help, I want for y'all who actually work hard to say, okay. If I get on this this dude's ass for let's say buying fake shit or being lazy, y'all gotta say, wait, hold up, nah. Feel me? Like, 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 uh, and he's fair to us who work hard. So if he's on your ass because you lazy as fuck, you buying shit, you're not dropping, well then you can't try to hurt the homie. You feel me? Type shit. I mean shit. As far as a motherfucker trying to hurt you, bro, like. This whole entire business don't got nothing to do with street shit. Facts. Like, like you get what I'm saying? Like, everybody entitled to their own opinion. Nigga, if a fan say your last song was weak, how you gonna you gonna kick their ass? Like it's it is what it is. Like true. Opinions nigga, some of my like assholes, yeah, bro, some of the songs it. that I thought was my best work don't even be the songs that actually go up. So like mm. you gotta kinda get outside your body and stop. Taking shit so personal, like nigga, the, 
timing is one thing that nobody ever put into play. Like you could, nigga, Bobby Smurda dropped the song six years before it blew up. Yeah, sure. So like, even if niggas ain't catching on to your shit right now, it's it's shit that you could be doing in between to make a song go because it's just probably not sitting in the right place. Yeah. Nigga, this song might blow up in fucking the UK and nobody mm -hmm. listen to it here. Good. So nigga, opinion is that shit ain't nothing. Yo, speaking of songs though that I feel like has been sitting for a while and I think you know. So me and Dejan, like we talked about it for a little minute, man. I talked about it with 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 um a few other people in LA media, right? Yeah. Like we said, yo, Wally and Kaylin got a certified hit with Come Slide With Me. Oh yeah. The sure. video I thought was filmed at some point, right? But why yeah. hasn't it dropped? That yet? motherfucker finna drop later on this month. Really? Yeah. Wait, wait, we're like, like that's locked in. Yeah, the video finna drop. Give me 30 days, that motherfucker be out. Yeah. Because, bro, like, the song went viral and on, on TikTok. Yeah. It went crazy. But even, like, the audio itself got, like, 3 million views right now. You feel me? Right? Just on YouTube. Right? So, like, that's a record that the world needs. You feel me? Right? So, that's Thanks. dropping. Yeah, yeah. Look, the record with me and Kaylin, Come Slide With Me, dropping in the next 30 days. Mm -hmm. I just dropped some shit with Mozzie and on BPZ. Mm -hmm. I got the tape with Greedo dropping this summer. I got a single with Ty Dolla Sign and Blast finna drop. That shit finna fuck the summer up. That shit so Oh, hot. oh where? Wait. All right, now, okay, let's, okay, now listen. Now, now, let's have the real conversation. All right, what up? I love Blast. I feel Blast is supremely talented, but it felt like Blast had the run where he was like scorching hot, like, bro, like everywhere, right? From Burner Boy, and it felt like he kind of like, got too comfortable and the sound sort of like got right like like the sound itself never evolved or he just sort of like stopped working which i, I don't know but yeah why nah, do you he, feel like blast hasn't really like like took in like the next step yet since like nah, i one? think he just took it he just you ain't seen the shit he been doing lately he just did Ooh. some shit with a with a hispanic artist i think mm. like That's i think a whole i market. think what he doing right now is smart Oh, because okay. like really you could see and that nigga work is, is he kind of like one of them if it ain't broke don't fix it mm. type niggas which is true yeah. like you feel me I'll be listening to audio books and shit in the morning my nigga G Perico put me up on some shit that I'll be listening to and it basically give you the game it tell you exactly the the routines of a successful business and it tell you the the coincidences in a business that failed yeah and like Blast he he meet like all the standards of a successful business. So I can't really say nothing negative about yeah. it. And then that's his crossover is happening right now. He doing it. Man. You probably ain't seen it though. He just, I don't know I the see, nigga I see, name. Uh, like, uh, it's the song with a him and feed, right? Or, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. So you seen it. Yeah, I think he, yeah. I think he in it's a, in a right now. he crossing over right now as we speak. Man. Yo, bro, Um, and who produced Damage? Cause that's like a new, like, right? Like, well, it's an old record, but like it just sounded like just so different from like yeah a Wally record. Um, the homie XL, XL did it. Shout out to XL. That nigga, he made that beat, and I freestyled that shit in like five minutes. Yeah. Um, and, and who I did was it to like like was it auto tone? Like it, it was like your voice was like right like. Hey, let me I was see. yelling. How I was yelling. No, 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 you uh, no. Play it. Wait, he, he here, right? Let me see. Now he look, gonna you gonna get niggas uh, flat? No, 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 no. Funny as fuck. Nah, man, nah, nah. Look, watch this. Let me see. Real, let me play it like uh, just like five seconds. And like, like. You see, like. Yeah. Yeah, it sound like a fil it's filtered. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we put a little tune on there. Nah, yo, listen, bro. Like this hard, man. For me, but I. Right. So look, let's get into like the warm ups. You feel me? So suspect, man. Now, while reacting to this, I said that suspect is like the old breed of Negroes, right? Like the <laughs> Nat Turner, Frederick Douglass, <laughs> Dr. Umar Johnson. You feel me? Tariq Nasheed, real defiant, uncooperative nigga. Which is, which is again, which is a, a, a good thing, right? Cause let's be real. If it was me or Remo. 
Y'all niggas would've shut the fuck up. <laughs> right? Hey, feel me? Hey, hey. Yeah. He said y'all niggas would've shut the fuck yes, up. Yes, saw all that shit, man. <laughs> man, you know me, bro. Yes, saw. You feel me? You know me, bro. I'm going I'm, I'm going to talk to a nigga however I want to, bro. Uh huh. You know? That's just me. You know what I'm saying? Like, Of course. You feel me? I feel like that's just part of my character, bro. Mm-hmm. If I was to, because then it's like you picking and choosing at that point if you only going to, you feel me, argue with certain motherfuckers or say something to certain motherfuckers, I'm arguing with anybody. Whatever happened, happened. Yeah. All right, so now when do you feel like it got, um, it, it crossed the line? Because, right, so look, um, so people was like, yo, and he never said white, but I feel like it was like an hour before your actual argument, like you said something like, uh, like I, I'm not going to listen to to like a white man tell me about uh, about numbers over over art, right? Feel me, right? So I feel like he probably like held on to that, and that's what he's probably thinking, right? But yo, 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 bro, yo, Hurley, can we play it? Yeah, uh, yeah. I feel like I debunked that later when I used Lush as my reference. Mm-hmm. You know, the Wally, that's right? a white so man look, who, who who know a lot, right? Look, so him and Adam was about to squabble. Don't say about the squabble. Nah. Yeah, look at this, man. They had an intense argument I wasn't about the squabble, bro. I argue with everybody. I definitely wasn't about the squabble. If you thought you knew more hip-hop about me, you wrote the conversation. At the moment that you start arguing from authority and arguing that your opinion is better just because of your life experience. No, that's what you're saying right now. No, fast forward like to where like like to say that you should like like it got to like where nigga I'm church like that. We talking about J. Cole over Kendrick. This nigga trying to tell me that J. Cole is it's over you Kendrick and all this bullshit because Bill no, 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 Bill right and now, all this shit. And I'm like, bro, you know, bro, bro, I'm I'm talking about right stop now. talking while I'm talking. I'm about to argue with you about billboards and all of this shit over Kendrick, it. nigga. Get the fuck out of here. So that's where that shit started from. This nigga talking about J Cole better than Kendrick because billboards. No, no, no. Adam, come on, we can take a head up over this. I have a legitimate opinion. I was arguing this nigga about Kendrick. My opinion can't count compared to yours. That's what I said. I said the moment that you insinuated like the. The, the moment that child was ready, and then you said like, oh, like suspect knows more than hip hop about me, nigga, you came in hip hop in 32. I was born into hip hop. What are you talking about? I've been listening no. to rap since I was a no. tiny I'm, child. Bro. No, but this argument is no, no, you no, no, taking no. an L because you're arguing that I Listen. can't have an argument. <laughs> I'm not saying you can't have an argument. No, but Stop you're arguing that. that my opinion. I didn't say you can't. But have why an is argument. my opinion less no. relevant than yours? I didn't that's say that's not what, the kind of thing that look, people look, 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 will. Look, no, look, on a podcast, look, 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 that's not what you do. You don't tell the other person that their opinion doesn't count I didn't because say they're white or because they're, they're old or whatever. Well, that nigga said shit crazy. You're lying. Yo, fast forward to like the like like the middle end. You part like, like we're like it, it gets heated heated i'm saying but i'm just, just saying, who your wife, gets to have no 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 no, no no bro like i get to have an opinion because i've been hanging out no 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 back some more back 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 oh, you I just, my yeah, problem yeah, is that yeah, he's yeah. playing the victim now when he's the one who started it. Oh, you did. Oh, you tell No, because he dissed me and like made it a take personal attack farther. before I, I did, and now he's farther. acting like a victim. I like, I'm you, got you it started it in the streets. Hip hop? Yeah, I mean, get the fuck out of here. No, it's not. Right. So, 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 so because he was a fan, so you're being a fan. He was hanging out with hanging out with How am I a fan when I've made, you got it. I've experienced Look, more success got it. within this culture you got it, bro. than like almost you anyone got it, ever? Cool. You right. No, no, look, look, I mean, cool. how is that a fan? Hey, right. look, look, what you're saying is you're covering cool. the entirety of it. You feel cool. me? The whole thing. I feel like, look, and, and y- you let's make go read the comments. off of it. Right. Let's so go read you comments. do Wait. know what well, you're saying. Yo, yo, right. You do look, know. like, uh, like fast forward for, for the like. The comments was like, heavily like, in your favor. I would have like, like, in like, this uh, space if I wasn't in the space. I took that L in the first time. I was just to tell you how successful I was. The whole thing is, y'all arguing. But now you're playing the whole thing. I had no right to tell you. You didn't. I'm not going to disrespect you back because you're my boss, so you got it. Oh, no. We went too far, bro. Like, the back up, like, like, you know what I'm saying? Just what you sitting here all day. Nigga trying to say, oh, what just what would you do with your rap career type shit over all the years? Respond to that though. Basically, nigga trying to flex and force me to do the thing that I don't normally do, which is just to tell you how successful I am. Anytime a nigga flexes, I'm richer than you, he lost. He lost. We're not even talking about money. We're not even talking about accolades. We're talking about knowledge. A nigga. And my reference for motherfuckers who didn't understand when I was using the gangbang analogy, I got two gangbangers with me, so I'm using an analogy to explain to them. Can a nigga tell you more about the West Side than a nigga who wrote a book about it? A nigga who studied it and wrote a book about it could tell you more about your hood than you? Mm, no. no. 
No, you was born and raised in it. Your pops from that motherfucker. A nigga who studied it and wrote a book could tell you about your hood more than you. Yeah. Well, and he said, yeah, they could. So that's when that's when it started. You know what I'm saying? Like, no, it, look, he just took the L in so many ways. No, no, right. So look, so okay, so the experience, no, right? But like, the for example, beats everything. Yeah, right. But though, in terms of like, can he like tell you like the history of your hood more than you? Yes, right. You no, can probably, he can't. He wasn't even there. He has to ask know. somebody who was there. Yeah, nigga, tell you anything. Right, you're talking about. You're trying to learn about it, but if you was there, you don't know. It's first hand and second hand. The you, you, you was there right now, but you wasn't here like fifty years ago. You feel me? You ain't never heard of the game telephone? Yeah. How a message get disconscribed every new person to get told to? As you get what I'm it, saying? You will tell a story to a nigga, and then it'll sound different once it gets to the fifth person. It'll be a whole different story. Nigga, you'll ask all kind of niggas and then tell a story. You wasn't even there, and you'll tell it half wrong. You get what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Like nigga, being a spectator and studying it, you will never be able to replace the knowledge of actually being there. And that was my whole analogy. That nigga, you was thirty. You came into this space at thirty-two. Nigga, I was born into it. My pops an underground hip hop legend. Nigga, and I'm such Gary, but I did my shit. You know what I'm saying? So you can't tell me more about rap than nothing when you wasn't in this shit until you were thirty-two. Well, I, I disagree with that though. I yeah, feel like, right. I feel like you uh you can't just because he started making money off hip hop at thirty. It wasn't money. You what? What was he involved in before thirty-two? A fan? I mean, if you're a fan, listen. Nah, to that's you. different. Right? Uh, you know more about being a fan than gang banging than when you actually gang banging. No, but like, what are we talking about? Nah, I'm just listening to music in general. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you can still just be as a nigga who make music just because you listen to it. You don't know the ins and outs of making music. You're listening to it. I feel like there's a lot of fans who listen to music who has a lot of knowledge. Know than a, yeah. But just because you real, just because musician. you record music don't mean that you know more than people who listen. I ain't to music gonna cap. Too, as far as the J Cole and Kendrick conversation, it's just about like niggas having a different type of brain. Like some people can't. Some mm. people don't got the got the capacity. To understand yeah. how dope Kendrick really is, so that argument how dope is, is he? all, it's always gonna be annoying. Kendrick's he's not the best. He, he Kendrick don't agree. He feel like J Cole watching Kendrick. Kendrick, the best rapper in the world. J Cole how? can never fuck with Kendrick. He can never in his life. Uh, uh, okay, we question, can go right? song. I don't even gotta explain it. We can go song for song right now. But Kendrick, no, 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 Cole, no, 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 better no. than Drake right yeah. now. Yeah, he is. yeah, Cole. Cole. What are we talking no. about? Fame or actually? No, we rapping. talking about rap. Oh, rapping. This is rapping. Oh, 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 he's the best rapper in the world. Fuck no. That's another argument too, right? Rapping. Wally, let me ask you a question. When Kendrick was talking about the big three, was he talking about popularity or skill? Talking about skill. The nigga Adam talking about, he's talking about big. He's talking about fame. Nah. He's talking about success. No. He don't give a fuck about success. He want to rap better than you. Nah, nigga. Kendrick is the best rapper but in the Jay world. J. Cole was talking about... Can't none of them niggas rap with Kendrick, bro. Who? Like, like I think, I think Drake... Nah, you think, bugging, bro. I think Drake... Bro, bro, bro listen, listen. No, the reason he is not listening to them as the big three. That, that, that's, how how sorry, that's how sorry this whole game... Mm. How watered down the whole game and the fact that crazy? the that fact Drake that they even, even in the, the same, same conversation. Sentence. How are they even? But the also, y'all from the West Coast, so y'all gonna have a bias. No, we can. talking about oh, rap. We talking about a nigga. We talking about rap. He can rap better than we Drake. talking about rapping. No, but we, but yeah, I don't we think so. Song, I don't think we go so, verse for verse. We go song for song. Just because a nigga like great music, like just no, no, I'm saying just because you can understand Drake better. Does has nothing to do with whether nah, he rap better. He makes be just because we talking he makes about better rap, music for you to ride around to. We don't even know if Drake writes his rhymes. We talking about and rappers. That's what I said, how we gonna I don't know if Kendrick writes about his we, lyrics we talk, to the go. Yeah, we don't we even know. We, we bro, what are we talking this nigga about? We don't even write all his lyrics, and we compare him to a nigga that's the best rapper in the world. What are we talking about? I don't think Kendrick better than Jay Z. We got this nigga up here because what are we talking about? Drake or Cole? I don't think Kendrick's yeah. better than Jay-Z. He for Listen. sure better than everybody in the world. No, 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 no. Right, right look, now, that look. nigga's the best with the pen. Right now. No, yes, no, no. He is. No, right? But hey, 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 right, hey, right. But look, right? So look. And that's why, like, the combo of, like, skill is tough, right? If you right? think Drake belongs so in a disappear. conversation with Kendrick, I will never respect your, yes. your opinion. What's the rap right? flows? 30 like, for we, 30, we can never, him in New York. No, it's right. Like, we, 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 Toronto, bro, them yeah. niggas, bro, them niggas, like, when Survival? it comes to rap, not entertainment. Nah, you yeah, bugging, bro. Not, talking about not entertainment. Pop. When it bro, comes to rap, rap, yeah, star. rap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Drake is a pop Fuck star. entertainment. But really rap. That boy Drake bro, really rap too. Bro. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, we don't even, bro, he rap shit that people wrote for him. We talking about rappers. We don't know that right now. We do know that. That shit Ben got Kendrick put out. Kendrick correct. I'm nah, not, I'm not taking that from him. Kendrick one of my favorite Game. rappers, but I ain't going to lie. As of lately, the nigga Drake. As of Drake, lately, Drake, Drake is, shown Drake is that the his, biggest artist Drake in the world. Drake has shown yes. that his pen is there. He's the he biggest to, entertainer when, when in the world. Rap. He ain't rapped in years. What are we talking yeah, he about? Is, he is, yes. This nigga crazy. Not so crazy. Drake hasn't rapped in years? 
Like nigga, Kendrick, do you if anything, I Kendrick has a rap career besides that one album. He don't got to. Do you know? I'm saying like the shit that besides he made. Besides that one album, yeah. what look, look, this is what I'm saying. Whole rap album too, by look, the way. Look, look, the shit that Kendrick is making, that shit come in full form. Like so, you was fucking with the last that's, album. That's real rap. I'm saying what Drake is doing, bro. I could, you could do that. Anybody could write you a song and you could rap it. Fact. He drop off, but 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 really talking about something like I'm talking about this of nigga Ken, Kendrick albums be spiritually there, lyrically they there, metaphorically there, like like I'm talking about rap, bro. Fifteen grand talking about rap. No radio music. Not talking about and Drake has the and, most, and most, I'm not most talking about stuff. a nigga just getting shit wrote and then rapping about shit that's gonna sound cool. I'm talking we talking about Kendrick rapping real life. Bro, and he got like, 15 Grammys. Why like, you would never understand shit. it because uh, has you don't stuff. understand it. Nah, that, Kendrick is my favorite rapper. That's all it is. I don't, I don't heard the Pimp and Butterfly. Niggas, niggas Good can't Kid, get, Mad City, niggas, Section 80. Niggas can't you get there. Niggas can't get there. You have a different from being a fan. I can get it. I get it. I understand. I know You don't get it. I know all his shit. Y'all don't get it. I just know that Drake lately been barring niggas out. Y'all don't get it. Y'all don't get it. With the right. It's all right, though. No, no, no. With the right, right, right. There's nothing wrong with that. Here, right. It's a look, right. It's a look, right. It's a look. Folks, wait. Here, right. It's a look. So folks will say, "Yo, bro, like," and he has more classes, classes, right, classes than Drake. And I, I'll say, yeah, 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 yeah right, right. No. yeah, yeah, right, yeah, right. Because I'll say, wait, wait, pause now, bro. Okay, so take care is the one where we all say, okay, that's a classic. We not arguing. I right, cool. Yeah, that's entertainment. Right? Cool Good entertainment. Great. I, I, I cool. views views did something only for other. He didn't say one bar on take care that fucked my head up. Not one. What? But no. it was great music. But he sure. didn't say one bar. I was like, damn, let me listen to that back again. Well, he, try. You well, know what I'm saying? Like, well, he, every bro, single I more. Lie. This nigga Kendrick done. Well, every like, Kendrick bar. Kendrick, you Kendrick to got the songs, songs that you'll never, you will never oh, well. get from anybody else that you'll never get again. Niggas like, don't understand, like bro. I don't know. It's, and he I has one of those songs, even, though, and that's Duckworth. I can't even. He this got plenty of them motherfuckers. I can't even, like, get deep into this convo because it's that, it's that much nonsense. How? Wait, uh, wait, 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 I have a question, right? Wait, 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 okay, right, here, so look, okay, look, so in 2017 was his last great body of work. Not everybody at work he dropped was great. How, Mr. Morale was, like, great to you? Yeah, he he evolving. Like it might not. We be, forgot about it though. It might not be great to so you. Was we you forgot. But about I I'm not no, saying it no, wasn't all that. I'm yeah, not bro. saying I'm not ain't, saying ain't that. No spins. I'm not saying that Kendrick been dropping songs that a nigga want to ride around and listen That's to. That's what I'm saying. Day. Y'all bumping it. But I'm saying I'm saying every song got a a different place to be. Like you know what I'm saying. You got to remember how big of an artist all these niggas is. Just but, like when Drake when Drake goes sometimes he'd go ahead and start dropping shit to sound Jamaican. It's not right. for you. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's a place for it, but it ain't sure. for you. But if you pay attention to where a nigga at in Somebody his life, to it. you pay attention but to where he at in his life, though. like this shit might go on movies, fashion shows, whatever the case may be, songs got different places to go. But Yo, every, every, song every body of work, I'm going to say this though, every body of work that nigga ever dropped is some shit that you are not going to get nowhere else, that you can't just... You can't grab a nigga off the street and he rap like Kendrick. Nah, hell well, there's nah. plenty of people that you can you can make another Drake, bro. Wait, 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 wait. That's a lie, bro. Like, we got Baby What's King. What's a lie? Baby King not on Kendrick level. That's Baby King not on Kendrick. Yeah, what the fuck Kendrick that got to do with if Kendrick? If he goes there, we can say, Yo, King, give us damn. Right? Nah, you give can't. us damn. Good nah, Kid, nah, Mad City, one of the best albums of all time, bro. You out of your mind? Hey, Flacco. You smoking Flacco. You show sure is. He a producer too, and he raps like the nigga. But he he ain't got no classic Man, shout out yet. to Baby King. Baby Duh. King dope. Shout out to that he, man because him Baby and King dope as hell. Oh, but, but I'm just yeah. saying, we, can't we started him with this Kendrick. conversation about J. Cole and Kendrick Lamar. Uh, then y'all started bringing up Drake. Uh, then yeah, niggas started bringing Kendrick up Jay Z. Like, what the <laughs> fuck is y'all talking about? Uh, 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 Kendrick okay. is the best rapper in the world. Bro. You said, all right, that's no, why we started bringing yeah. up other people because you said in the world. Yeah, yeah but we started between the conversation them two niggas, about J. Cole. J. Cole But can when you never say the world, that's when it's like, I don't J. Cole know about can't that. Fuck with wait, Kendrick. though. But Kendrick's wait, not wait, the best wait, rapper in the world, though. For right sure, now. he is. I don't Ooh. know. I don't think he got Jay Z. Wait, though. Okay, so look. Okay, look. So, in terms of like the catalog, then Kendrick probably overtakes J. Cole. But. We don't have. We talking proof. about rap. Yeah, well, we, 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 we skills. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, 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 fuck catalog. Fuck entertainment. Skill. Look, look, look. Who, who, 
We could say Eminem. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. That nigga Eminem, nigga, skills, Eminem like we just going fuck with, off skills. Fuck Nobody fuck listen to Eminem. Eminem, Eminem one of the greatest rappers songs. ever. Eminem one of the greatest rappers hey, ever. Skill wise, Kendrick. If it ain't Kendrick, it's Lil Wayne, bro. It's no, it's nothing above or under that. It's I'm not Lil fucking, Wayne. It's got them two Kendrick. niggas. It's Lil Wayne and yeah. Kendrick Lamar, the best rappers in the world. In 2023 and 2024, J. Cole had had like the year of, okay, this nigga has proven he's the best rapper, You're crazy. right? And on the planet. Bro, what? Listen, the song with Yachty, right? Uh, like, like, right? Bro, listen, yo. Wait, wait, hey, hey, let me like, hey, watch this. Let me like, Pull this shit up real quick. Right I now. will say, J. Man, Cole, I love J. Cole. Lady, I love J. Cole music, but putting him next to Kendrick is yeah. the worst thing you could ever do. How like, 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 Kobe would never be Jordan, and LeBron would never be Kobe. It's been five you know years though. Wally says Kendrick has told us that he still knows how to rap. So what? It's, it's been five years. We forgot. So what? Huh? I'm saying, what? I'm saying that the product that he giving you is the project is, was trash, is, bro. We don't remember nothing from it though. Man, that nigga project is some shit you can't comprehend. You come from something else. How that's, though? That's cool. Oh, There's what? nothing wrong with that, bro. No, hey, right. I don't, I don't think it's that. It's nothing, I'm a nigga. Wrong, it's nothing wrong with that. It's for sure. I feel that. like that project just wasn't it, though, compared not, like, not, he just gave us, to like. He too. just gave us the it's, Pimple Butterfly, which was kind of like that. on the same realm. Yeah. So it was like, he, I feel like he should have switched it up with that one. Of course. I feel like he had to get back that's to the people. That's your opinion, though. But yeah. I'm saying, yeah. I'm saying this. What gives, no, what makes y'all niggas opinion so valid? Well, but that's the same like, thing like, with like, you too. No, no, I got hits. I wrote hits. I sung hits. But True. So, what, what just makes, because you're no, an but, artist don't mean no, no, that. No, no, no. But I'm as not, a fan, I'm not I can't just, have the same opinion. I'm not just an artist. I come from the same blocks as Kendrick. So, so that's what I'm saying. You from somewhere else? Yeah. You wouldn't understand. I, sure. I, when I hear it, I'm knowing the names that he's saying. I know who these people is. So then you're I, no. Hold on, hold on. I'm I'm listening to to his to his words from mm -hmm. the same place he was in. Okay. You get what I'm saying? True. So I understand that, yeah, like, I might look at it different, but at the same time, that's why I keep saying skill level. Aside from all that, skill-wise, yeah. none of these niggas can fuck with him. But you're coming from a biased perspective. If you're no, going to say that biased. and say, hey, I'm I saying can feel skill, it more because I'm from I'm here. I'm saying putting all that it's to not the about, side. It's yeah. not about that. All of that to the side, skill-wise, skill none of these wise, niggas can no, that's fuck not true, with though. that. So look, skill set wise. But y'all never answered my question. What makes y'all opinion so valid? Okay, perfect, right? So look, what, what have y'all? Yeah, I feel like you don't have what, to have a valid. I feel like, I feel like making I feel music. Like you hear it different. When I feel you like are. just you know because you what, hear it I'm different. I'm saying, what have they done to prove like what I got do you great have to taste judge in music? music. What? Ugh, what? Nothing. What? Should we sitting up here with y'all? I'm it's, working at no jumper. Bro, it's the same. Bro, that, I'm not up here for judging yeah, you. Yeah, nigga, we I'm up here. here. We are. We up here. We talk no about music all the time. I'm at no jumper, though. I didn't come to get an interview from Remo. I'm Fuck. saying, now I'm up here. what have you done in music that says, I got great taste, the world know it? Okay, so, like, like, yeah. like, you know what I'm saying? If I tell you I can fix your car, you gonna say, have you ever fixed a car before? Like, right. Like, do you have a what's license? Your, what's like, your act, Can you recommend? What's your resume? You, you don't have to have a resume to be able to t Please, say. Not bro, an opinion, but have an opinion matter. on music. Are there, it's a matter I'm saying, I mean, I'm sitting up here with y'all right now. I'm you saying, can have an no. opinion. I'm sitting up here with y'all right yeah. now. I'm saying, are there any review? Like, Let me answer that question. Can I search your name up and it says, oh, this nigga fixed my car? He did this, he did that. Yeah, look. I'm saying, where in your, like, even the same thing with Dijon, though, because. Because I had that question about Dijon when yeah. he first started grading niggas, yeah. and he proved me wrong. You feel what I'm course, saying? Yeah, of course. He actually been dealing with music for years. I didn't know that. I didn't know he was playing behind the scenes so long, which I still don't agree with 90% of the shit he say that got to do with music. Of course. And I fuck with Dijon because he an honest nigga. He going to keep it real. And I, I respect it, but I don't agree with it. But I'm just saying, like, see how Dijon was able to say, like, nigga, I've been doing this shit for 10 years. Like, you know what I'm saying? Of course. I mean, I, I can this, say I, that, I was I managing that. artists and shit too. Like, managing I, artists don't. That's mean what Dijon nothing. was doing. Dijon was managing the artist 10 years in the game. No, nah, but to he figure out his lane or no, whatever. No, but he didn't actually. I was been, writing songs and shit at one point, ghostwriting, whatever. Right, but all right, have you ghostwritten anything that took off? Nah, never. See what I'm saying? But like, I feel like just because you never why, no, no, but had I'm a just, placement don't mean that your opinion isn't as valid as somebody else because they have. 
I mean, I think it do. Yeah, I don't do. think so. Yeah, that's that's crazy. No, I'm not gonna take advice do. from a nigga at at uh, nigga Skip uh, Bailey sit up there and talk gym. about sports all day and don't and even play. Yeah. Yeah. Don't even fucking play. Right, right but, but, but who? Nobody. Who give, people niggas is listening to Skip who Bayless, play ball who take, or the nigga who, who just commentates? He up there all. He up there. Who takes Skip Bayless more? The nigga who plays ball or commentates? Nah. Nobody, a lot of nah, people listen, like, watch nobody Skip. Take the world takes Skip seriously, man. A lot of people watch Skip shit. You don't have to. No, no, you don't no, have to record a song bro, for your opinion to be valid on music. They watch it because he's entertaining, not because they take him serious. Right. Yeah. Like, Skip ain't finna tell a nigga something. If Skip told me I was weak in basketball, I wouldn't quit. Like, Skip Bayless ain't stopping nobody from... Chasing they, did, they put him on there with Shannon Sharp. People more care so about Shannon Sharp. It's actual entertainment. Athletic... Uh, uh, Opinions and sports opinion because it's just entertainment. Played. All this Skip shit Bennett, is entertainment. Like, before Shannon, though, though like, you can't he, have like, 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 I ain't gonna I'm lie, bro. That. I'm not gonna sit here and lie and say you own no jumper podcast because you got a fucking hundred percent music and yeah. music opinions. That's that why that can't here. be why none That's of y'all are sure. here. We're not gonna cap. Here, right, so because look, wait, 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 right? So look, in terms of like, um, who should have an opinion and why it should matter, right? There's only like two criteria, right? So like the first criteria is, do you have ears to hear music? Yes, yeah, cool. And the second is, do people care when you say something, right? So, right? So look, so if you have ears, right? And you say, yo, this shit is trash, and people care about like your opinion, then you should have, right? Like, right? like, like, like I. I don't think you need to have like 10 years of like label experience, right? I think that's dumb. As long as people care about what you have to say, then you have the right to say I'm it. Michael Jordan. Not I everybody, got a, everybody got a right to an opinion. But of that course. don't mean it's supposed to matter though. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Anybody for sure have an not. opinion, but that don't mean your shit. Like 95% of the people who opinion matter shouldn't even matter. Like all no. the niggas that, yeah. that control what's going on in media right now, bro, that, bro, even people at labels, they don't know shit about music, bro. Nothing. It's numbers. They have no idea, bro. If they knew enough about music, yeah, then it'd be a big gap between the niggas that got it and the niggas that don't. And there was yeah. the niggas that got talent would all be yeah. rich as fuck, and the niggas that don't wouldn't. It's certain niggas that uh, would have never fans, made it. There would still be artist though. development. Do they yeah. not come get you after you already? They don't know it? shit about. They don't music. develop nothing no more. Well, hey, well, hey, true, but the fans is who dictate who opinion matters right so for example if i think that i know like a bunch of my music but when i say something it don't move the fans or they don't care about it then my opinion should not matter right like the fans dictate in who opinion sh you know like sh should now, like hold yeah, but you gotta remember everybody hate it no nah, but uh, I mean, for one matters. for one yeah. bro you gotta remember that the majority of people is like kind of slow. Thank you. Like when you when you say fans, you talking about all type of motherfuckers. You ain't you ain't talking about niggas that got nigga that high. Never did nothing. Yeah, excuse me. You ain't talking about niggas with high GPAs or like nigga. When you say fans, it's kids that sit at true home and yeah. comment on this. Of course, and though. comment on real shit all day. Yeah. Like like I don't think that nigga none of these things that y'all are using to validate shit. I don't think none of that is real. It's all that's all fugazi. I feel like everybody's opinion could be validated in a way. Like, I don't feel like you have to be a songwriter or you have to be a, an active artist or an old artist for you to have an opinion on if J. Cole or Kendrick is better. You like, can have like, an opinion. I'm just saying game. who it matters yeah, Anybody to. can have an can opinion. Have an opinion but that though. don't mean that that yeah. shit really is critical or it matter. You never did But that's what everybody no, does. I said that's 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 what No, I'm saying that don't mean that it's valid. Right. right. Like, nigga, I could sit here and say anything right now. If you can check... The proof behind it that make it factual. If you can't, then it's not valid. Oh, hey, like, bro. like, like yeah. right now, if I say, "Nigga, Kobe was the greatest basketball player ever," that's why they got stats. That's yeah. why they make rings. Like, it's, and w, a damn it's lie. ways to validate what I'm saying yeah, or true. not. Yeah, true. That's all I'm saying in music. So how really, do we validate they're, who's they're, the best rapper? Wait, 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 wait. I got you, Wally. How? So look, in terms of like the skill set conversation, it's all subjective. So you said what? There are stats. There's the numbers, the championships, and that's against no, his but, argument of no. We talking the to a nigga that got validate. Yeah, yeah. We talking to a nigga like, that was hot. Uh, you, you, we talking to a nigga that yeah. got a stream for him if, and then try to say <laughs> that numbers is validation. No, yeah. no, it's not. No, no, it's no it's not. wait though, right? 
that's and entertainment. That's you can't fake that's, you started game, yelling though. out Grammys and that's, shit. So that's bro, no, 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 no. That's entertainment. The only reason I, I that's not Grammy, skill set. That's the entertainment. The only reason I used the Grammy that's argument was because he tried to say that J. Cole shit sells more. And I was like, you can't say that nobody listens to that shit when he has 15 Grammys. Hit that sells more right now, though. He said nobody listens bro, to that shit. Bro, I ain't going to cap. Yeah. If, if you had Kendrick Lamar at No Jumper today yeah. and told everybody pull up and then had J. Cole tomorrow and told everybody pull up, you telling me that wait, you wait, think... Hair? What, yeah, God? We're on a you West telling Coast. me that you think J. J. Cole could pack out a arena better than Kendrick? It, it's I mean, we're on the West Coast in L.A. I no, 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 no. I'm talking about in, in, nigga, in 100 countries... There's nowhere that J. Cole from the outside. My Kendrick. argument no. wasn't with J. Cole. Yeah. I'm not I'm a Kendrick fan, so I, I think Kendrick yeah. Lamar is a better rapper than J. Cole overall. I fuck with his music. No, more. overall, but in the last 12 months, in the last J. Cole 12 feature months, run, bro, it's been J. Cole, bro. I give bro, him that. Bro, you J. cannot charge. You, you cannot. But I will say, you Drake is a better you artist than Kendrick. Bro, you can't scale greatness with 12 months. Facts. That's crazy. Facts. It's been you five years since we- going on in his life. He, well, wait, but nah, so just if, we, if bro, you keep going with the basketball bro, analogies, bro, bro. But I'm we saying, can just be saying a nigga been playing like making, trash this year or having The shit playing. that he making, it don't matter how long it take. I'm saying what he producing is some shit that's going to stick for life. Like, like, but it ain't stick for a week, though. Like We no, forgot about it after like two weeks. No, it ain't sticking to you, bro. That's why I said I We're understand. bumping it right now, though. It makes sense. When well, last time you bumped that last album from Kendrick? I bumped Kendrick. I play his old shit. But I'm, I'm talking listen, about the last album that we're talking about right I'm now. Saying, I'm saying that that shit is not for me or you or him. I'm saying that it's a place for it, but it don't have to be us. You got to remember that a nigga is at a, at a different height, a different time in his life. Like, it's not for you, bro. It, like, certain songs I make don't even be for niggas. I know the homies in the hood going to like this shit, and they going to hate that shit. I didn't make it for them. I don't expect them to listen to it. Look, right? to be fair, I'll still be bumping some tracks on that shit if I'm keeping on it. Mm-hmm. But in the conversation, I was just saying that I yeah. believe Drake is a better artist than Kendrick. No, no, right? Skill wise, yeah. he's a he's a bigger entertainer, but skill Man. wise, bro, Drake don't belong in that conversation. He's not in that skill Drake, wise, he's you a wanna, know, I think skill wanna, wise he there bro, too. Drake belong in a conversation with somebody else. How, Literally, fact. Wait, how the Kendrick nigga Lamar, with a pop star. bro? bro, bro okay. Like niggas that created hip hop is y'all be having niggas rolling in their grave. Hop. Like a mother, like y'all niggas talking about Drake. The hip, like, the bro, hop, the hip, hip, bro, hop. You bro, don't stop it. Don't know so, come on, niggas is ass, bro. Niggas trash nah, too. Nah, you don't know nothing about <laughs> rap, bro. Yeah, you not a rap yeah, fan. Yeah. You an entertainment fan. True. And it's cool with that. That's cool. He said, like, I'm trash, not even too. a rapper, so I'm obviously going for something else. Like, you know what I'm saying? I still keep my substance, but I'm going for entertainment. Yeah. Like, like I'm, I'm yeah. trying to make the ladies happy. I'm trying to, and at the same time, make niggas. That's from where I'm from, or from any slum, just keep going. Like you know what I'm saying, like. But but rap is something that I do understand. You a rapper, rapper though, like right, like. I for example, you don't rap. No, don't no, rap. no 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 no. I know how to rap. We heard guidance, sure. bro. Like and he can rap. Like like like. Y'all he, didn't he, see the freestyle I just did at uh at Bull Bull Cap. Cap. Uh huh. Man, I be fucking niggas up in the booth. You feel me? Oh, hey, a question though, right? So okay, right? So look, so I had the same critique for Lovada, right? Uh, because bro, when he I heard him it. rap, yeah, right. When I heard him rap, I said, "Yo, bro, this nigga like, if he takes just rapping seriously, but he's like a top ten lyricist, right?" And on the West Coast, but he don't like he don't do that though. You feel I me? Mean? Like he just you know like you know he does like like you know like the party songs, right? So why I, I guess you as somebody who has the ability to really like fuck niggas up with the rap shit because people don't care about that. Why you know like why do you like like not do that often? Um, because honestly, that shit is just for fun for me. Mm. Like, I don't want to be in that race. I just like to be able to show it some, like from time to time. Like if I got to, mm-hmm. like, hell yeah, I do it. And I do it on my free time. Like I started off doing music as a rapper. I started off rapping not singing. You feel me? But singing is, is where I begin to be in my own lane because it's a million rappers and True. it's a million of the same songs and niggas talking about the same shit. Me singing is just being able to express the same shit, but in a different way. Like mm-hmm. I'm able to separate myself. Now you stand just, out for just sure. based off that. That's why I do it. Oh, look, right. So look. So and here's the one song right where I say, "Yo, Wally has separated himself now." Right, um, and it was a Sorry Mama record, bro. Yeah, you the- be you be paying attention though. I give you that. Yeah, man. Feel me, right, bro? Like a song that's that, bro. Like. Just like 
that's like that vulnerable, bro, again, I just don't think that most niggas are even like tapped in enough to themselves where they can like go to a studio and pen some shit like that, right? Yeah. Right? So like what exactly inspired you, you, right, saying, yo, I'm about to go to the studio today and make Sorry Mama? Damn, damn, I don't want to lie. I'm trying to remember. That I don't I don't remember if that was my idea or Jay West's idea. Okay. Really, but what I know for a fact though, like just giving her her flowers. Yeah. I, I talk a lot enough about my homies and like niggas that I lost or shit that I've been through. Of course. But at the same time, my mom's dope. Like you get what I'm saying? Facts. So I hate feeling like, damn, like me coming up here talking about being homeless or Oh like, yeah. Talk, sure. Just talking about all the wrong shit yeah. and never talking about what she actually did good for me is that's that's out of control. So I just had to give her flowers one time. Being able to call her and say, listen to this, I made this for you. Shit, oh, really? That shit was just a good feeling. Man. Yo, hey, listen. So me and you should do like a 24 hour vlog, but we have to like survive being homeless for like 24 hours. That's it's going to be easy for me. I don't know about you. Huh? <laughs> it's going to be easy for me. I done did it. I done did it enough. I don't know about you. Like, how do you survive though? Like, where do I like. You got to thug it. It's all kind of ways. Mm -hmm. Watch my ass at a gym, a gym. I right. four hour fitness membership. Yeah, but you can for sure get a twenty four hour me yeah. uh, fitness membership. If you ain't never been hungry before, you wouldn't get it. Nah, listen, I'm always hungry. You feel me? We know that. My bad. That's Wrong one person. of the best ways to deal with it, though. Getting that membership. Facts. Get that uh, membership. Well, you can take yeah, a shower. Hell yeah. yeah. You can go in there whenever. Take your shower and, and shit. you can go hit the, the pool. Yeah, Facts. you can hit the pool and hit the weights. <laughs> oh, oh wait, or wait, hold up now. You just get an Equinox Knox membership for like, for, for like 300 bucks a month. Oh, and you straight. You can sleep yeah, in there. You, same you, shit. You spy in there, you feel me? Oh, okay, well, okay, well, then, you feel me? Then it's cool then, right? You well, got to be able to make that 300, nigga. Huh? If you don't make that 300, show up. Bro, listen. Fam, listen, y'all. If you in L.A. where, bro, bro, like, bro, like Chipotle. I know Chipotle, some who ain't seen $300 in, it, in the last year. Nigga. Huh? I know niggas who ain't seen $300 in the last year, nigga. How? Shit, these niggas be pumped. Bro, bro, I'm wait, wait, you, wait, bro. These niggas bro, what kind of pumped. starving niggas you with, bro? I, I'm not saying with. Nah, come on, my nigga. Bro, three, bro 300 <laughs> is crazy. On. You don't know niggas who starving right now? I, nah, bro, but I'm 300. I'm starving now, bro. In the last year. I know nigga who is starving and living off somebody else right now. Come on, now. Everybody do. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, pause. So you know a nigga who ain't touched $300 whole like all at once. I, I know a nigga who ain't never seen a thousand dollars all at once. Oh my mama. How? Oh my mama. He ain't never had a job? I don't I don't know, bro. These niggas get like 300, 400 spent on drugs or something. Huh? Get a little I don't know what niggas be doing, bro, but I didn't seen it. Hey, I didn't see hella niggas. Hey, brother. Call Big Blood. Like for sure. Where? I didn't see niggas out here poor. Fucked yeah. up. Fucked up. He nigga. just called me. I don't know where he Nothing. I'm sure he, he have a job. I sure know some niggas who ain't never seen twenty five hundred dollars nah, time no, before. Nah, no, 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 no. Hey, he come from a hood where they all got money. Who? Y'all right? I'm not saying his homies. I'm saying anybody. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like this nigga, it's for sure niggas with money in my hood. But nigga, you crazy? Nah. Growing up, nigga, that don't like another nigga money don't got nothing to do with you. I Facts. mean, certain niggas, it's, it's D boys, it's all type of niggas yeah. that might have some money, but yeah. Like, it's way more niggas with no money. And that don't mean it's jumping for everybody because five niggas got money. Ooh. It's not jumping hey, for though. everybody. Well, hey, right? But do you know a nigga, though, who haven't touched $1,000 all at once before? Yeah. Nah, come on, Wally. Nah, do. bro. I do. Mm. I know a nigga who Shit, ain't never. Shit, probably. I do. How? Bro, it's a job, bro. Not a nigga, bro. Listen. <laughs> bro, listen, bro. If you go, listen. Some if you go and work at McDonald's, bro. bro, for 80 hours, bro, you gonna touch some a thousand dollars. Some niggas gonna touch these lace up and on and and You gotta remember, shit, nigga, minimum wage was like seven dollars when we was ah uh, true. Now like, like nigga, a thousand dollar a check. What? That's uh, you ain't getting that. You're not getting that. <laughs> no, Unless you was getting six. 50. Like when growing up, hell no. Six hundred. See what hey, right? True, right? So look, both six hundred. I got the most. Damn. You feel me? Six hundred. Six fifty. Now though, kids making like twenty bucks an hour. Yeah, Feel me like at that, McDonald's. That was unheard. This nigga rent five thousand dollars. Everything high now too though. Facts. Nigga rent thirty two hundred. Bro, when we were kids, good. you used to be able to get four bags of chips for a dollar. Twenty five cent. Hot fries. Twenty five cent each. I'm like, like, like everything was cheap as fuck. Yeah, nigga, nah, everything. Shaka yeah. tiki. Inflation for like fifty. Fifty mm. cent. It was bussing. Oh, bussing. No, yo, listen. 
So the oatmeal cookies and the 25 cent hugs was my shit, bro. Feel me? Right? You no. Listen, that, the 25 cent hug, the 25 cent fruities, right? Like the candy. No? Your you, motherfuckers was 10 cent when I was growing boy, up. Boy, man, listen, bro. What, the little strips? Yes, little yeah. Fruities. Little powder you, strips, you know what I'm talking about? The sour ones? Those two were like you go with the little cent. clippers were, yeah, and you can put cheap. them in a bag yourself. Yeah, them was, was like cheap. five cents. Nah, these right here. So the, so the he talking little about the fruit. fruities that you give in the ice cream. Shop. Yeah, look, these right here. Let me show you. Yeah, show me. I'm gonna the flack green, up the uh, green and red ones. Like the green and red ones fire. These right here, fruities. Yeah, I don't remember them. Yeah, but ten cent. No, no, he gotta remember these. Let me see. Let me yeah. put it closer. He gotta see it. Nah, bro. Like, come on now. Like, Fla you Flacco, to, what's your pantry look like in 2024? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Them was bullshit. Nah, hat, what? Nah, them was fire. Bull, bro, I used to say I was fucking with Mike and Ike's and We got some of them in the car right now. Oh, I was bro, fucking with nine later. I need some shit. of those, bro. I nine later, Mike and Ike's. Ike's. You Mike feel me? Ike's, shit like yo. that. No cap. Red Hots. Man. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. Unless you go up around Mexicans, you're not gonna know about the hot fries with the nacho cheese in that, girl. I'm my mama, nigga. I, I, I what, had that what? last night. Wait, huh? Tell us niggas. Yeah, Tell hot fries with the queso. Tell them. Easy. Nigga, hot fries. Hot Cheetos with the yeah, queso. Get that nah, nacho. Pickle yeah. with the boule. Yeah. Bro, wait, what? Yeah. Wait. Pickles and boule. Mm-hmm. You too up now, Wally, to be eating. Fuck like, you mean? Like, <laughs> well, I'll go get some gummy bears and put some Hot fries and nachos, right nigga. <laughs> what? Hot fries, nacho cheese, gummy bears with Kool-Aid. Bussing every time. <laughs> Listen, I feel like that concoction is only available like where like corner stores exist. Seven Eleven, right? He right, but Seven Eleven. They starting to put them in Seven Eleven. Yeah. They just don't use enough for the for the good shit. They don't use enough for the boule. Or the no. Thing. Yeah, you got to get the cheese. It's like watered down. Make it yourself. Shit. Yeah, it's not the same as the ice cream truck for shelf. But candy houses. They you don't. Got, they we got, got any super chats? No candy houses. Y'all want to read some of these super chats? Yeah. Candy houses. Yeah. 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 So look. You know what's crazy is though. Like, this is the last time I'm going to say something about it. Look, 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 What's look, look, look. crazy is, bro is from New York. Mm -hmm. Bro is from Philly. Like, you would think with, with the hip-hop background that right. they come from, yeah. that they understand rap. Bro, it's it. so crazy because, like, he for the past, the, South, two year, the past two years, though, like, he's right before Alabama. everybody, like, anybody who know me, Kendrick Lamar was my favorite rapper. Like, nigga, I would argue How long niggas. Kendrick been in the rap game? Shit, uh, since Section 80? That's when I started fucking with him. Oh, what? So how long? Nah, bro, nah. But since I like, 07, like right? Section 80. That's All right, so 07 to, two, to 2024, Kendrick and, and, and me, you still no, relevant. Listen, listen. 07 to 2024, and they trying to debunk this nigga status based on 12 months. You know how many niggas lasted a summer? In the discussion. They know how many niggas lasted a summer and disappeared? In the discussion. And we never heard of them? Bro, you know cool. how hard it is to be true to yourself and even be that big Fact. and like actually do something that's that honorable? You like. like like, and bro, not Kendrick ain't Listen, never. I'm still, I still fuck with Kendrick. K no, I'm, I'm saying, just saying everything that I about think he ain't this nigga, with Drake. everything about his 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 talent, his art, but, his skill set, everything about though? his swag, everything, right? Now you taking it too far. Kendrick all is crazy, bro. bro. All of that shit is bro. original and honorable, bro. And, but what's swag though? Still, Kung Fu Kenny got swag, man. I ain't like, for he, I'm not saying bro, the whole bro, thing he's saying. I'm just saying I think Drake about it. I love Kendrick, always, bro. I love Kendrick. See what I'm saying about the valid. The first word bro, I, like, see what mind. I'm saying about the validation part. What's up? Look at your fit. <laughs> yeah, come on, this is hard, now, man. Now, what gives you the right to talk the about right to validate flag. swag? What? Hey, he's just like me though. You my boy. <laughs> what though? He's just like me though, Wally. He's just like me. Oh no, what? Now he does, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Wally, man. Look at this, man. Come on, Wally, man. Come on, Wally, man. Oh my God. Man, now hell, now, man. This nigga right here. Come on, man. Wally, look at this, bro. <laughs> he's man, retarded, nah, bro. Nah, nah, hey, this nah, nigga is funny as a you, motherfucker. Man. Nah, he's retarded, I'm gonna find bro. this shit for you niggas, man. I'm gonna find this shit. Man, come, man, come you got on, a specific Wally. outfit? Man, come on, man, come on, bro. That's my shit right here, nigga. <laughs> hey, let me see it. He said, this is my shit. Man, come on, look at this, bro. <laughs> Don't, touch that. Nigga, Don't touch that. That's my shit. Don't touch that. That's my brick. Don't touch that. I got back Don't touch that. That's my. Nah, come on, man. I... So look. Like, okay, so. Nigga like, hearted, no, look, Tell me. look, and he's a good rapper, um, and he has a great message. He's somebody who I will want for most rappers to be like Kendrick, right? Because he has a good message. But I'll be real though, I wasn't fucking with him trying to talk that gangster shit, um, in order to like that track. You feel me talking about 
He oh, got the right to though. How though? He's like a we poetry did, nigga, man. Bro, like, he like from, he from the, he said from bro, we we from the, the originating fuck? place of gangster shit. About? And who he shoot? What do you that have me? to do with anything? You uh, you uh, never hear it. Man, can, man, come on, man, come on, bro. I don't, man, I don't, on, bro. bro. I ain't gonna cap. I don't, I don't even care what a nigga did. Yeah, of course. You feel what I'm saying? But I'm saying he from the originating place of gangster everything. Sure. We are the original gangsters of the world. Sure. Now listen. So, now when Drake's talk, when Drake be talking about sliding and all this shit, nigga, you was on the grass. Bro, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Wait, wait huh? Come wait, Drake really? Bro. Wait. You just asked huh? me. Don't you, do just, that. you just, just asked me who? Pay? You just what? asked me who Kendrick shot. What? What but how many thing? times have Drake talked about? Bro, everything this nigga talk about X, don't X, have X, nothing to do. have to go and catch a body like that. Don't have nothing to do with his real. Hey, X, 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 Wally, hey, do your homework, Wally, do your homework, Wally, do your homework, man. So you're saying Drake killed X, 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 I don't know nothing about it, man, feel me? Bro, what's wrong? I ain't never seen Kendrick Lamar get subpoenaed for a murder trial, nigga. Why would you? Drake did. Why would you? Drake did? Come on. He said Drake did. Come on, Wally. He is the guy, dude. The DJ Khaled. This conversation, bro, this conversation is over. This man said, then he said Drake killed X, if you think Drake, if you think Drake sli sliding on anybody, That's you crazy. out of your fucking mind. Oh, 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 wait, oh, 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 wait, though. All right, look. Okay, look. So when Pusha T bro. got his first show bro. in Toronto, a hundred bro. niggas stormed that stage, bro, nigga, trying to poke him up. That don't have nothing to do with Drake. Drake. But what I'm going to say is Drake, this, though. Drake, Drake, this is what I'm going to say about Drake. That nigga is the biggest artist in the world, yeah. and y'all make him weak. When y'all put him in these conversations, how though? Because, He's a better because, rapper than... because it's exposing where he not strong at. Like, just give the nigga his flowers for who he really is yeah, and what he song. really do. Look. He a great That's entertainer. He a, he the biggest entertainer in the world. Okay, let him be that. Oh, wait, wait, don't put. He's a pop don't, star. Bro. We not gonna put Steph Curry in the conversation of a slam dunk competition. Right. Steph Curry is a great shooter. Let him be that. When you start putting them in conversations with Vince Carter and uh, Tracy McGrady and shit, that's when, mm -hmm. like, you know what I'm saying? It don't make sense. Like, nah, Drake this is shit, it, up on it make his value lesser when we even have these conversations because he really is dope. Everybody loves Drake. We're going to see when that, when that uh, Kendrick cool. diss drop. He, they, but Flacco said, fuck with Doc, Flacco, you said you got the scoop that Kendrick, I mean, Drake dropping the diss this week. That's what Flacco said on the news today. Listen, I was told. There's a 95% chance Drake is dropping a diss track this week. Now, now listen. Oh, also, too. Oh, oh okay. So, so, right. So, the Wiley, right. So, look. So, speaking of gangster shit, right? Yeah. So, um, there was rumors, right? Uh, that back, I think, in like 2013, right? Um, yeah, back in like 2013 at the MTV, I think VMAs, right? At the after party. Uh, so Kendrick Lamar, who who is now popping it, he's now the biggest gangster on the planet. Back in 2013, Diddy wanted to get up on Kendrick's ass. And it was J. Cole, his big homie, who stepped in and smacked up Diddy and fucked him up on behalf of Kendrick. So I'm saying, bro, like, how can you like now like dish your big homie? Bro, I don't know what the fuck <laughs> you talking about. <laughs> but um yeah look what head no, that's the thing though that's a, I don't know what this nigga talking that's about that's the thing though for real but and yeah. I ain't gonna lie he's crazy. I ain't gonna lie bro I ain't even finna indulge in no conversation True. with being disrespectful to bro True. cause he really the best rapper in the world bro y'all can't be mad at that you can't make up no fake narrative you can't do that you can't do that bro True. Hey, a lot of big listen. homies parts out of pocket, but what? All this, yeah, all this big homie shit and smacking up Diddy. I don't know shit about. Nah, J Cole did step in for uh, Kendrick know, Lamar. Bro, I don't know shit, shit about none of that yeah. shit. The true. Hey, but hey, so y'all might need to get Kendrick on here so y'all can ask him some shit. The true. So look, all right. So look, so uh, until Kendrick dropped drops an album, right? Because again, and he dropped that album, and then all the songs felt like. Fell like off Billboard like completely. Meaning, right now in 2024, as we speak, right now there's no songs from that album currently on the top Hot 100. Shit, he chilling. The album fell off, bro. You feel me? Nah, nigga, it's 2024. Uh, 
If I had right, look, right, look, right, look. So, uh, so JT and Young Miami are currently feuding, right? So, uh, the big question is, who do you have the most faith in moving forward for a solo career, Young Miami or JT? Hmm. You first. That's a good question. Yeah, man, you first, man. Hmm. I don't listen to bitches. Me either. No. That's a good ass question. I'm not gonna lie. Better solo career. I don't know Carisha low key and shit with Diddy. I don't think she should drop nothing. She in that case with Diddy and shit. She need to figure that shit out first. What that got to do with JT? music? Because niggas yeah, you know right. how the fans if any, do. If anything, you that shit gonna make your music go yeah, more. Nah, them. niggas, I'm they fast. just Nick, look. This sure. is 2024, bro. The fans just tried to slaughter J Cole for saying trans in his song. You can't do nothing. I'm be real, fans bro. Slaughter you. I feel like Kendrick Lamar's anything. label put them up to that. I feel like her. I feel that like that her music is sell more. If she, I feel like her music is sell more based on that Diddy shit. Mm. I don't think so. Women, you gotta realize, women. We wouldn't even be Diddy. talking about her if it wasn't for the Diddy. But shit. But none of sure. us up here is gonna listen to that shit. Uh, no, how? Women. No, he did mean? that shit. Look, you know, women stick together, nigga. He did that shit to females and once, like Chris Brown, his whole. Wait, he did what to females? Still, allegedly, the rape him, drug him, beat him. That's what I'm saying. Y'all niggas don't really <laughs> the know. Little allegedly, I'm Bro, not saying what we know. We I'm ain't in these. These is real people in the real world. I'm talking about what the fans saying, not what I think, bro. Right, but 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 historically. Whenever you involved in some drama, your music sells more. Not always. I ain't never seen nobody go viral. Not always. Coyle and, Ray. And their music do less. Coyle Ray. Um, yeah. um, Sweetie. I could go all day. Wait, what you mean? Nigga, they was in all Coyle Ray. Coyle Ray. Coyle Ray. They flopped. Had good numbers, but her mm. music is trendy. It flopped, I doubt, I doubt that her music flopped because she got more clout. I'm saying, though, her controversy didn't help her sell. She flopped. I don't know. Sweetie controversy didn't help herself with Quavo. Flopped. I mean, I don't know. I, I don't feel know like Young Sweetie, Miami has been I don't know way more good like music, controversy though. than them. Like, well, yeah, true. I'm true. not saying uh, that shit or not, wait, but wait, I'm just yeah. saying, you know? I don't know. I don't know if her music is good, so I can't say. I don't listen no, to I'm business. not saying if it's good or bad. I'm just saying what uh, perception of motherfuckers. But that'll mean. make it. That'll play a big part in why you flop, though. Like yeah. you, We in a world right now where songs are trendy. Like, you making, they making songs that are trendy on TikTok. Like, like that's your best chance of sticking around is making trendy shit. But I can't say that trendy shit is good music or is best the best music. So like it's it's a weird we in a weird space right now as far as like honestly everybody that dropped nobody's doing as good as they say they do. And mm. talent don't sell no more. I feel like there's a window right saying this right. So so look, and if a person is selling like ten thousand copies first week, there's not enough strength forms in a world. Who can make himself four hundred thousand copies first week, right? But if he's selling, let's say like three fifty or three hundred or two ninety five, you know, they can boost it to like four hundred. Or if he's selling ten thousand, they can boost it to about fifty. I don't feel like streams make your music good though. I don't feel like like streams make a difference in how good a song is. Like I know. I know songs that I listen to right now that's like the best songs I heard in no years. Oh. And they don't really got that many views. Like, I I'm telling you, talent don't sell I feel no like more. music's just in that weird of a space. Like, it's the character. It's oversaturated. I feel like there's too many people making music. Everybody think they can do it now. So it's just oversaturated. Every, and, and everything timing. in general is oversaturated. And but timing I, play a big part in this shit. Like, but the thing yeah. is, though, the views is the key thing that make people want to gravitate the towards this shit. So that's why the best era views is a, yeah. a, a big part of people who talk more people yeah. music. Because a lot of these people don't even care. Diversity, because like they, that. they don't care about the That's skills. The majority of people is followers. The followers, exactly. This is like the worst time in music, to be mm. honest. Facts. He said this mm. is the best. Nah, bro. <laughs> wait, well, nah, You're right? Crazy. Wait, wait, it's wait, no, a no, new no. TikTok hit every no, week. No, 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 no right? that shit be ass. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, right, hey, right. So look, and here's why I say, one, this is the, this is the best era, right? One, us as black creators, we now have the power, right? We are empowered now to go ahead and drop something and do our own shit. Yeah, with yeah. without the labels, it's so, easier. But I don't mean yeah, it's as bad. far as that, yeah, sure, it's sure. easier. But honestly, I feel like we need music. That. I mean, yeah. Afro Africa, Afro beats. Yeah. I feel like they having a good time in music. Yeah, they, yeah, they're they they for sure having a decent time. Like Afro mm. beats is is becoming like the new pop. Yeah, I honestly. feel like the bar but, has been set so low now that niggas ain't but, even trying. But there has been shit. no R and B that that did good in a long ass time. No it ain't R&B. really no R&B artists. It ain't really hip hop. Ain't at the top of the charts as like it used to be. 
Wait, like, what, I feel like Spanish music, song? African music, mm-hmm. and drill music been, you know what I'm saying? Can I'll be real, bro. It's my own, listen, I'll be real, bro. Like, the drill shit is plummeting now, bro, right? right? Listen. It, it's plummeting now, but yeah. shit, they had a good a ass crazy run. They had a good ass you run. Feel me? Right now, look, look, right? Because, like, 2020 to 2020, I'll say three, bro. Like, bro, like, bro, like, the Bronx drill shit was going crazy. Yeah. Now that shit kind of my like, nephews they listening to K Flock. Oh really? Yeah, these they kids. They I feel like the drill shit ain't never gonna go away. I feel like people as long as respect, niggas gang banging and dying is gonna be people real. respect real shit like that. So every time it's some real shit, it's controversy be new. shit is it's always gotta be a new city. It's, it's gonna, gonna be a new city. It's gonna be beef. Philly. It's gonna be Maryland. Oh, oh Philly's right now. Philly is next. Philly drill scene coming up. Going crazy. Crazy. You feel me? Pay Memphis pay drill scene going YBC crazy right now. Duel. You feel me? Like all these niggas. Uh, uh, Ot Seven Kwani. Like nigga, it's a whole Philly drill wave right now that's going crazy. No. Crazy. And they're like hella, bro. It's like, bro, look, 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 like, like their beef show. These niggas is dying, bro. I look, bro, I look at that shit like, bro, like these niggas are like 17, 16 years old, really out here like catching bodies and going on drill, which to me is kind of crazy, man. It's like that everywhere in every trench, bro. Oh, for look, sure it is. Yo, yo, Hurley, can you go to like the like like the California like uh um and school system? So. I don't have a kid, nor do I have my family who are in school in California, right? So, so apparently they're, uh, no, down? Yeah, just. Jesus Christ. Oh, okay, go to like, 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 Jesus. like yeah. What the I see hell? y'all got Meek Mill up there. Yeah, bro. Yo, yo, bro. So like, here, so go to like my Instagram and just scroll down. God damn. Right? This Look, some crazy comments. This is some crazy topics, boy. <laughs> what? what up in this shot? What up? Nah, it on oh, the on topics there. list, Isn't boy. Crazy, no crazy topics up there. Yeah, man. Hey, go to Flacco Instagram page. Yeah, yeah, right. So nah, look, not them, nigga. Them links, them links was crazy, nigga. Oh uh, uh, man. Now look. So California is proposing a new grading system for the kids. Hmm. Let's take a look at the new grading system, dear. Currently, yeah. Scroll down. Okay, we just hit like 107. Hey, hey, bro, we're going crazy right now. Down? 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 And mute the song too, by the way. So down? Down? Yeah, right? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, no, no, yeah, yeah, perfect. Mm. Yeah. So, wait, okay. So can you yeah. like, 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 like a- 64 uh, B? Nigga, I would like, have straight Bs. Like zoom in? No, or yeah. I would have enlarger? straight A's and Bs, nigga. A B is 60% and up? Yeah. You could probably hit Shit. like nigga. I would have had a. I don't want like, to college, hit, Yeah, I had a three point uh, five. Save it, bitch. Or like screenshot it. That's crazy. Yeah, like yeah, like snippet tool. So go. Oh yeah, true that right. Yeah, true. Yeah, I, I nigga it say <laughs> true. A is an eighty four percent to hundred. B is sixty four percent to uh, eighty four. Uh huh. A C is forty six to sixty four. Yeah. A D is 24 to 45, and an F is 0 to 25. Yeah. Yeah, Nigga, facts. Nigga, I would have had all Bs. Nah, uh, right? No, facts. No cap. S- right? So for y'all, you I'm feel fast. me? And who have kids in, in the California, like, you know, like, you know, like, uh, and school system, man. That's crazy. Like, what's your take on this being, like, the that new means, standard coming These soon? kids is dumb as fuck. That's what the fuck mm-hmm. it means. Huh? I ain't gonna lie. My daughter in Hey, listen, bro. Uh, I'll be real, bro. If I was in school and a 65% could give me a B, nigga, bro. I feel like the school system really have failed us the entire the time. Yeah, like, like the year, school the system, nation. bro, I don't have no faith in the school system. We got I don't feel like it's the niggas. kids. Like, I feel like the school system is trash. Y'all ain't never seen when them niggas walk in our, around. In our nights. country, in our country, we got a terrible cool. school system. Y'all never seen when them niggas walk shit. around with the microphones asking uh Americans question and shit and it'd be like dumbass Americans or something. These niggas are dumb as fuck, bro. You wanna know something? Yeah. If you sat five kids right here, right now, mm-hmm. and 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 tried to explain podcasting mm-hmm. to all five of them, mm-hmm. like, do you agree or disagree that you might have to break it down differently to each child for them all to understand it? No true. But like I feel like that's just learning, right? Right, like right. right. So I'm yeah. saying, so so school, school wise, what mm-hmm. the fuck make these people think you could sit 35 kids in a classroom 
and they gonna all learn the same thing the same way Facts. and be graded off that. There's not enough resources yeah. for every kid to learn separately. True. When everybody don't learn the same. Some niggas hands on, some people gotta see it, some yeah. people gotta get it worked to them a different way. You know what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. nigga. Like you might say two plus two equal four. He might think three plus one equal four. Like you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. He might say one plus three equal four. Like it's it's never gonna it's, Yeah. You can't even teach five grown niggas the same shit the same way. Yeah. So no, that shit, that shit's stupid. Look, true, but I do think though, like the answer isn't though, like yo, these kids are fucking stupid. Let's just like lower Lord, like yeah. the grade in. Yeah, that's crazy. nah. Kids, yeah. be, kids be smart as hell. Smart as fuck. My we daughter stupid. Eight, she in school, smart as a motherfucker. We are the stupid ones. Yeah, but it's just making it where like there's not gonna be much Come effort on, on the kids' behalf. You don't like, gotta all do I gotta shit. Do is pass. Is get a you don't gotta do nothing to pass. Oh, B yeah. in the, oh, wait, 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 bro. Listen, look, bro. Listen, bro. If you can't get an A, bro, I'm judging you. Right? What the A say? 80? 84. Yeah, 84. That's a B, bro. That's crazy. Niggas know. We was in school. Uh, 84. Uh, uh, 90 a was a B. That's a B. Right in school, right? Yeah, right? Right? Uh, right? Like, it was like 92 up. Nigga, I ain't yeah, never 92, had one of them. About 92, 91. I ain't never had one of them. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> no? <laughs> Hell you no. never had an A before? No. Nah, I wasn't there. Like, I wasn't fair enough. It's me? not like I'm just dumb. Yeah, I, I, didn't, say, I didn't go. I, I had 38 days present in high school. You feel me? Like, I was years. never there. Really? Wait, wait, like, your parents, like, it ain't get in trouble? Oh, like, no, they was on my team? ass, but I didn't get no fuck. Shit. Um, my mom's moved out when I was, like, 15. Mm. And then I wasn't going to school. Shit, I was going. doing other shit. Where you went to high school at? I went to like five different high schools. I went to Oilfield. Mm. I went to Centennial. Which one? All of them. Every last the, one on one Artesia. Closer? No, no. All the ones up Artesia. Ah. I went to every Oilfield on Artesia. I went to Centennial for two weeks. Yeah. I went to Compton <coughs> High. I went to Dominguez for like three days. Yeah. I was getting kicked out of everything. Oh, wow. Really? I even went to Mayfair for like two days. Wait, wait, wait. Like, like, like what's that? Like Mayfair? That's a high school. Uh, I went to a shitload of high schools, and then I end up I end up going to jail. And when I got out of jail, my class was graduating, so I went to Bompton Adult School, got my GED. Nigga scored fourth highest in the city though. Oh, oh, you? Yeah, on my exit exam. So you smart as fuck then? Yeah, I, I could have went to any college except two. Wait, wait, wait. I right. so uh okay right. So then like like here right okay. So then like why did you choose I guess rap? Oh, I didn't choose rap. Mm. I wasn't rapping in high school for real. Ah, like that. I was. I was chasing other shit, chasing look, money, look. and I had a kid already. In what? In, in high school, right? Yeah. What? At, so, at, at like what? Fifteen? You said right or no? No, nope, seventeen. Okay. She was like on the way. Right? I had my baby on the way when I was sixteen. I was looking at some jail time. They was trying to give me like six years for a robbery. Damn. And oh, armed robbery. Shit, when I came home, <laughs> <He's> <laughs> fucking police. <laughs> no, it's an old case that yeah, yeah, right, right. <laughs> right. Yeah. Some oh, other shit. Ah, uh. but but yeah, I think it was like strong arm something. It was a basic robbery though. Yeah. Wait, wait. I, okay. Uh, okay. So look. So so what? Like you seen some nigga walking and he yep, looked and, like me and grabbed his ass up. He looked too sweet. He look like me. Nah, everybody I used to run across was getting robbed. I ain't gonna lie. I was out there really robbing shit. Damn. Snatching chains every day. That was just how I was eating. Wait, though. Like, okay. So, like, you come and say, yo, give me that with just fist? Walking or give me that. Hey, nigga, give me that. Nah, just taking it. Beating your ass if you gonna, if you gonna fight for it. You gonna get your ass kicked. Damn. Like, I'm talking about everybody was getting their shit snatched, bro. My whole little squad, we was out there taking everything. Oh, a lot of people know. A lot of motherfuckers probably remember me from robbing they stupid ass. Have you robbed like, any rappers back then? Um, not nobody that you all know. Mm, I got you. Like the peons wild, who like ain't make it. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm. Not nobody that you all know or recognize. But you hell yeah. Hilarious. Yo, listen, yo. So, okay, listen. I robbed a nigga for 15 cent one time. I was mad as a motherfucker. Damn. <laughs> you robbed him for 15 cent? I robbed a nigga, nigga and then when he, he, gave, yeah, he gave me everything in his pocket. He only had a dime and a nickel. You got oh, you I, I gave it back to him. Of course, right? Like, come on now, bro. Like, listen, listen. 
at that I point, bro, like, I, that's what had me hot. Bro, bro you want to know some funny shit too? What's up? Bro, I snatched a bitch chain one time. A girl? Bro, she was on the soccer team. I didn't know. Mm, well, okay. Bro, that bitch was so fast. <laughs> oh, <Lord. laughs> nigga, I'm running. I'm. I think that my my fast. my baby mama was going to winter formal, mm -hmm. so I'm like, oh, I gotta get some clothes. I gotta get some shoes. All this shit. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, fuck it. I'm. Just, I went up to the school. I I didn't even go to class. I went up there just to snatch a chain to my school. <laughs> so you I go, go sell it. I go, yeah, I go up there, I go in, the, it was a girl's <laughs> locker room, I walk up in there, because like playing sports and shit, sometimes when away teams come, we might switch locker rooms or, like, you know what I'm saying? So I went up in there acting like I had been in there and left something. Like, damn, I, I was in here earlier with the team, I left my phone. Yeah. So boom, I see my target, I snatch her shit. As soon as I try to take off, I hit the ground. Splat, I slip. Yeah. I get up, I'm booking. Yeah. And I like the lockers is right here. Yeah. But every time I pass a locker, I'm seeing the bitch. She she with me the whole way. Mm -hmm. And I'm fast, bro. Yeah. So I'm like, damn, this bitch fast. So when we get to the end, she jump in front of me. I kind of like, like uh, uh pushed her. Yeah, I tried. Like, like hit stick her through the door. Yeah. Boom, hit the gate and got up out of there. But that was that shit was funny as fuck. Was she white? No. Nah. Black? Damn. Hey, listen. You record. I you just be like a whole description. <laughs> well, what you mean? No. Like, hey. In terms of fact, hey. hey, listen. Oh my god. I, I raced a black girl in who did soccer and track before, and I burnt her. So I know that they came Man, fast. You feel me? Nah, she was fast as a motherfucker. Gina failed. Get off the home girl. You did not dust her. You raised Gina? Stop it. And Smoke pushed her. her and she failed. Nah, oh, y'all nah, gotta bro. get a rematch. Hell nah, bro. Yeah, bro, listen, you listen. Yo, listen, I was already in over here and she was behind me and then she fell. Yeah, bro, you feel me? Yeah. He cold. I'll I, I, I tell you, man. He cold. Am I gonna read them super chats and shit? Yeah, 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 yeah. Go ahead. Fuck. Read. Have y'all ever heard the song? Uh, Benjamin dropped $20 and said, Have you ever heard the song Live or Dad by. By Draco the Ruler, RP, and Horencio de Patrones, white American Mexican or Mexican American group, and if so, what did y'all think about it? And could there be more collabs with LA rappers? I have not heard I about it, but I, but I'm gonna check it out though. You feel me? Like yeah, that's dope. That's cool though. You feel me? All collabs. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's hard. Yeah, that's cool. All right. Like, what's next? Uh, somebody dropped ten dollars. Bad look for Adam. Hip hop is not YouTube. Can't just go off numbers. When he said that, nothing else mattered. Then then tried to flex on the homie, shaking my head. W says, shout out to Seth's guy. Uh, he stood ground. He stood the ground and explained the difference between a person who who contributed to a culture and someone who capitalized off a of culture. Oh, they popping it today. Boy, mm -hmm. boy, mm -hmm. boy, they they on your uh, ass. Somebody said suspect took the loss. He started talking about his race earlier on the video. Suspect died on his sword talking about race. I fuck with him, but he gets in his feelings way too much. You the only one who felt like I lost. Uh, mm -hmm. Everyone knew Sus was just defending himself because Adam Slick dissed him. When the super chat came up, then he then he strongman the whole argument. Huh. Mm. Uh, which one he was at? I don't know what the fuck. I read that one. Uh, oh. Flacco man, these LA dudes tripping. Kendrick mad that Drizzy got more fans, more bread, and more money. You out your mind? And got an anaconda in them. All right, bro. <laughs> what the yeah, fuck? Yeah, he, he just yeah. stupid. Yeah. He's a hey, stupid nigga. And he not lying though. No, like we seen what? it. He for sure lying. <laughs> this nigga is crazy. Niggas, we all seen it. Y'all y'all niggas. What? Hey, y'all niggas don't belong in this conversation. <laughs> you should have you should have kept what? your ten dollars. What did we all see, Flocka? It was a leaked video that went viral. I didn't see shit. Well, I, I I bet you didn't see it. I definitely did not see it. You crazy. <laughs> the whole world seen it, man. I didn't see that shit. You wouldn't search for it. I'm not searching for Question dick, for the nigga. artist. Let's see. Okay. Would y'all rather have a Grammy or a Diamond record? Man, if come on. If it's the Diamond record, then the fans' opinion more matter more than your peers. That's, that's so. Tough. You think your peers judge the Grammys? They don't. Some white people who got elected to judge it. That's nah, not your peers. Nah, Kenny Burr is like like was a voter. Um, and who was that? Would you uh, she's like a, a black or a diamond chick, like and who does like award. Man, come mm -hmm. on now. A diamond. I'd probably say diamond. But bro, listen, it's not bro, it's not even saying close. the fans matter because that's who's gonna make your shit diamond. I didn't say the fans don't matter. We didn't we could never say the fans don't matter because if it's no fans, there's nobody who's gonna make the yeah, music. But that's but validating that you that going down. No, 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 no. But that don't mean that the fans' opinion is gonna be over an artist's opinion. But, At the end of the day, you're gonna listen to what the fuck I make, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like nigga, niggas, 
if if you contrive to every fan what every fan say, you're not even yourself. If you drop a song and the fans say, oh, I want to like this, you need to go do X, Y, and Z. And then you go do that, you're going to be chasing shit. No, I'm not. I'm talking about from the... Like, the fans' word is not over the artists. No, I'm talking about from the perspective of knowing about hip-hop and shit. You don't have to, like, the artists and the, the fan. Like, if you... The Diamond record is... Nigga, Ice, the Ice Baby went, went Diamond. Went Platinum. That's a hard-ass song? No. Ice, Ice Baby. That shit went platinum. That's a hard song. Uh, objectively, no, though, that's hard, though. Were, no, nigga, not. Weird Al Yankovic probably yeah. went platinum. Thank you. That don't mean that the song is good just because the fans kept playing that shit. That don't mean it's good, bro. It's no, not about it's being good. It's a lot of terrible just, songs that I'm, went platinum. The whole point it is it's good, saying, though, right? Like, nigga, I mean, it's a good song. Hammer time went, went platinum. viral, but yeah. any song that go platinum, if it went shit, diamond, it's or, a good song, Yeah, bro. diamond. I ain't gonna cap. Uh, most artists that's real artists and really care about what they do don't give a fuck about no awards. Nope. Like... It's it'll be good to have. We all want certain things, but that shit don't have nothing to do with what we creating. But a like, diamond like, means you sold ten million copies. And, yeah, and bro. niggas want that. Yeah, mm -hmm. everybody want that. But I'm saying like, is you gonna sell out just to get it? Right. Like like if New York drill is hot, is you gonna stop making conscious rap just to get a diamond award? Damn right. If you really you care about what <laughs> if love, you really man. care about what you do, you not. What you saying is the means to justify. Is you gonna end. ride a wave like? Nobody that really got their heart in this shit ride waves. The means to justify Or just make your wave hot where niggas go diamond off your wave. I mean, going diamond ain't something you can control, bro. Like, some niggas is just blessed enough uh -huh. to experience that. But yeah. that's why I'm saying time play a big part in what we creating. Like, nigga, you might make a song. It might not even go up till 10 years from now. You never know. No, no uh, uh, True, but okay. But if you are an independent artist, I feel like you are choosing a diamond record as an independent artist over a funky Grammy. Oh, right? Facts. Right? So, so, which is why folks are saying, you know, like we put more stock into the, you know, into the certifications than the award shows. Meaning, Look, if Drake has like more, let's say, like, like, um, um, more, like, like, more like diamonds and platinum records, then that should weigh more than the Grammy. Look, I think if the Grammys had a no. better history of giving the right artists they right shit that they deserve, we would feel different about the Grammy. I don't think none of that determines whether who's the better rapper. So rapper, in terms of like the skill set of rapping, um, cool. I would still say Drake, but though I can hear you out though. Like right, we right, got right. niggas like, yeah, like bro, we that. got rappers like Juvenile. We got real legends that ain't got as much awards, mm -hmm. streams, or money okay. as niggas like nigga you NBA young boy got more money than more than half of these niggas. That don't True. mean that True. he's a better rapper than all of them. Uh he's a better rapper. You can't rapper go off the success, juvenile. bro. Success don't go off your skill, bro. Success is out your hands sometimes. Nigga, it just happens. But your skill is what you do yourself. That's you know why saying? that's why How do we just skill though? That's why I say Kendrick so hard because he ain't with what he doing, he ain't never. I don't. People I, skill I never seen skills. him as a person that chased success. I feel like it Ugh. came to him, and he blessed to have it. But nah, doing, he for sure but, chasing. But he be chasing it when he be just drinking them. Bro, doing what I'm talking yeah. about his entire career, like from the jump. He made damn, bro. Like what, he, what he was doing, his his style of music, Drake, it haven't been popular since he been doing it. <coughs> he, he he made, made damn it, the Wally. He made he it popular. Out. Is what I'm saying. Uh -huh. Like. Nothing about what he been doing since he came out have nothing to do with the rest of the world. Like, it was not popping. It wasn't a trend. It, it's nothing about it that says he only doing this just to be popular. Yeah, nah. He, he made, made people... He created his own lane, bro. And he made people tap into his world, too, though, for sure. Yeah, like, like we talking about what? real diamonds versus, versus... We talking about real diamonds versus lab diamonds. Yeah. Like, yeah, your shit hidden in the yeah, light. Yeah, Good Kid, Mad City drop. Like, he definitely made people tap into his world and shit. Like, he, That's real music. Yeah, for sure. One Ooh. of the best albums of all time, you feel me? Listen, but, though. But Drake's I, still just one of them niggas, you feel I'm me? I'm hungry. Yeah, man. Hey, hey, man. Uh, look, we about to end it, man. Uh, here, like, what's the last subject? Oh, uh, so Slim Jesus um, turned down $1 million from Diddy about eight years ago. Now he's out here now bragging about saying, "Do do y'all still think I made a wrong decision?" Now Slim Jesus right now is is a rapper that that done fell off. He's washed. So, I don't even know who that is. No, wait, wait, where you haven't heard like Frank Block goons? No, I don't, I don't know who that is, bro. He's the Frank Block Savage. Look, look, let me see, man. I'm I'll be out of tune though. Like 
I don't be in tune with he's, a lot of this shit. He's a viral white kid that went uh, he's, like listen, a, he man. some drill shit a long time ago. Yeah, yeah look, bro. Man, man, look, bro. He's a drill legend. Look at this. You don't know who the legend you Slim Jesus is? Boy, you is. Bro, boy. You was in 2014, you was in jail? Shit, I don't remember, bro. You probably was in jail or something. I ain't gonna lie. No disrespect to dog, but I, I wouldn't have listened to that in 2014. Look, him, look. Nah, him. that shit was trash. Him. I was listening to drill shit when it came out, and that shit was trash. I, I don't listen to a lot of people. I don't listen. Bro, him. I don't I don't push it in my brain. Like, I ain't riding him. around just listening to anything. I, I look at him like, 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 uh, he hey, bracking he, though. He got view. He got sixty two million views. He walks a little my book around. Yeah, he booming. Nah, like shout out to my book. Like, 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 don't do like the shout like, out like to the Slim gangsta, Jesus. Uh, I'm gonna kill do. you. Yeah, he do. Like, like you ain't hear a song with DDO Osama. They reenacted the whole murder in the video scene. What and it's some about? like trolling artistic shit, right? right? Like, like he's not really trying to say, yo, bro, I'm from this block. I was really out here like killing niggas when I was filming. Like, he's just, you know, you're not either. He went on a Vlad interview and said he don't do none of that shit. And afterwards, though, right? His first this whole shit though, like screams, yo, I'm really from now. Hey, you no. Know? It would have been different if he would have lied and said, nigga, I'm really like that. Yeah. Nigga, his very first interview, he said, I'll just do it because it's cool. Yeah, I don't, I'm, just making I'm not music. trying to be a thug. He should have lied, though. You're right. Nah, he should have lied. You're right. He, he should have asked some longevity. He should have. this shit, Wally. Bro, he had the biggest guns in his videos, bro. Look at this shit, man. Nah, that shit was like 12 years ago. I know some of the Come on, ever. bro. <laughs> Yo, he really, bro. He... Not tap in with him. This was that like Chief Keef and Lil J heyday type mm -hmm. shit. Chief Keef, Lil JoJo and them heyday type shit. And okay. he just popped up like two years later and did that shit. But he's saying that he dodged a bullet by not signing the Diddy? Yeah, yeah right? So, look, so he's trying to say that he made the right decision by not signing for, for a million. A million. Bro, you're broke as fuck <laughs> yeah, right now. I was about to say, like, <laughs> like I, don't know, I, don't why, right I don't know why I don't know why niggas' personal life be getting brought up into <laughs> the business so much. Yeah. Like, nigga, R. Kelly in jail right now for some bullshit, right? Mm -hmm. But, nigga, he still... Like undeniably, oh, one, R. Of, Kelly. one of the dopest niggas ever, nigga. R. Kelly really like that nigga when it comes to music. True. Separate the art from the person, bro. Yeah, like a I lot do. of niggas do freaky shit and they make great music. So if you asking, should you have took that million and blew up, or did you dodge a bullet? I'm gonna say you. Fumbled. He blew up though, like he fumbled. He fumbled the bag. Yeah. Not even that though, because he also got offered uh like I think a million from Birdman too. King, there's a whole viral video mm -hmm. of you King Yellow on the phone. Go independent and just keep going viral himself. He turned out work. Birdman, Diddy, and everything went uh, independent by himself and then plummeted. A so yeah. he really just fumbled the bag completely. So yeah, Slim Jesus, no, you should have no, took the million. No, and no, right, not not like and and right, and he started like trying to play like politics just way too early, right? Meaning this. Yo, bro, I can't fuck yelling. with y'all, man, for me, because Dirk don't fuck with y'all. Nigga. Dirk don't even like you. Bro, my point, right? Bro, like, they was fucking with you first. <laughs> look, right? Look, right? Look. So, uh, apparently, like, King yelling and them, right? I embraced them while everybody else was saying, yo, he's still in our, like, Chicago drill way. Fuck this white boy. These niggas say, yo, yo, bro, like, we fuck with the nigga, and he's our nigga. And then as soon as he, like, Got like popping, popping, and he said, "Bro, man, like I can't fuck with y'all, bro. You feel me? Cause y'all black ball. You feel me? I, I said, you yeah, when he bro. He was getting embarrassed at every show. The nigga did a show, boy. and the DJ took the mic and said, "Bring back real hip hop." Mid show, he doing his song. He snatched the mic <laughs> and said, "Bring back real hip hop." That's fucked up. And dropped that motherfucker. Like they was bullying this nigga in his. That's crime, fucked bro. up. He was getting bullied, bro. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. It, it was hella fucked up. Yo, and nobody saved that nigga either. Like who? Yeah. You came to the show by yourself, like. Where's your security? Where your friends? Did the nigga just let this nigga just walk up, take your mic, and just say, "Nigga, bring back real hip hop." Can, can we play that clip real quick? Oh, uh, uh, a Slim Jesus gets mic snatched, nigga. <laughs> mid show. Yeah, yeah, wild, right, bro. Wild right? times, nigga. Yeah, right. That's fucked up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yo, yo. Uh, last question, right? Like, man, grind. right? Uh, like, cause we about to like like end the show, right? So, yeah, right. So what like, you got? yeah. So no, hey, right. So look, so look, last question, right? So give me your top five. LA County rappers. No, 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 fuck it. Your top five West Coast rappers out right now. Top five rappers that's out, dead or alive or just alive? No, no now. Alive, right, yeah. Um, Kendrick, number one. Yeah. I gotta put. Your West Coast rappers. I gotta put Westside Boogie in there. That nigga hard as fuck. 
Okay, yeah. And he can really rap? Um, I'm going to throw... Damn, hold on. Give me a second. I don't mm-hmm. want to fuck up because I only got five, right? Yeah, yeah. five. You're, you're like What's our boogie to do that be with Eminem? Or you used to, oh, yeah, he hard. Yeah. Dot, West Side Boogie. Mm-hmm. My bro, Taj. Wait, Y'all got to do y'all homework on Taj Zafir. T-A-J space Z-A-F-I-R. Okay. Myself. All right. Because I sing, but I will, I'll rap you niggas. Uh-huh. My last one is tough because I want to put Savvy Third in there. That nigga talented. No, true. RJ, hella talented. Okay. Even Greedo, nigga. Greedo is like at oh. full capacity. Some of these niggas is, is at full. Like, I watch these niggas work. Yeah, like, nah, bro. Like, he also. And it's. Yeah, he it don't want. He's floating. That shit is sick. Mm-hmm. But um, I can't even choose, so I'm going to leave the last one open. It, them niggas is all greats. Mm. I look. Okay. So then I, right, boom. Uh, so then we heard that you and Greedo, okay. Mozzie gotta go in there. Mozzie is like well, come our, out there. Mozzie is like our generation, nigga. Tupac. I've never Mozzie, heard that before. Mozzie keeping gangster yeah. rap. Bro, I Mozzie never the, heard Mozzie, Mozzie the only Tupac nigga. Before. Bro, Mozzie the only nigga that is really doing gangster rap. Gangster rap. That nigga Mozzie been doing that shit by himself for and years. It's not like thug pain music where you're crying and you know. Like and I always forget to music. shout out my nigga Jay Worthy though. I always mention everybody else. And mm-hmm. shout out to my bro Jay Worthy because he dope. Them sampling that but, but, for sure, for sure. Okay, but who's the five though? The five gonna have to be Mozzie. So, so okay. Uh, so Dot Kendrick. So Westside Boogie. Westside Boogie. Taz Zafari. Taz Zafir. You. Mozzie. And, and, and you right? And myself. All right, and who's your top five? I I I don't know. Uh, I don't really have one, but I'm fucking with uh, I fuck with X Force shit. I fuck with O Three Greedo. Okay, yeah, man. Uh, Still in Shock is a hit. Kendrick for sure. YG, and then shout out to Jizzle. Uh, who who I don't know. I fuck with Roddy Rocks and uh Lefty Gunplay too though. Man, that nigga. Boy, uh, boy, you politicking, man. This nigga right here, man, is a co politicker. Politicking is crazy. You hear that, got, though, man? Co politicking. Bro, um, you know, damn boy, like, you're not bumping that shit. Nah, I've been. <laughs> what's, what's the My boy Steven been putting me on a lot of uh, Roddy Rocks. Um, uh, you know, Steven? He the homie nigga yes. Yeah, he, he be putting me on a lot of uh, Lefty Gun playing shit. Oh, yeah. He got a cold style. They hard though. something? Nah, he from Hemet. What's the nigga name? That's my nigga. I don't know right now. I just can't think of his name. He rapped, though. Oh, um, grip shit, buddy. Nah, buddy, hard as a motherfucker though. Yeah, that nigga, hey, that nigga, buddy, tight. I'm about to tell you his name right now. Yeah. Wait, all right. So listen. So again, so lefty is hard and Roddy Rex is hard. Spank Nitty James. All right, mm-hmm. cool. That nigga hard as fuck. All right, cool. Facts. But the but come on, bro. Like you're not bumping on, bro. Like and on like a daily man. Like I don't I don't bump X four and all these niggas on a daily either. But sure. I, uh, when it comes okay. to California, because I don't really listen to too much California true, rap. True, true, true. But okay. I, now that I'm tapping into it, being out here, mm-hmm. those are people that I've been actually like Wally. He hard too. Like yeah, he you stand yeah, out bro. differently compared to everybody because you singing and shit. So mm-hmm. like your music, I'm fucking with it. I was listening to it on the way here. Uh, it's a lot of niggas though. I fuck with four extras and shit. I fuck with uh okay, wait uh wait wait like rapping or X four? I think four extras got a song that just came out. Am I bugging? No facts. Yes, but though is he your top five? Nah, I name my top five, but I'm just naming I, everybody. Alright, right, so so top five, man. Um, uh, uh, West Coast niggas shit. And, and no politics, man. Um, top five, you gotta put EBK J Bo in that bitch. True, and um, free him. Yeah, free that man, uh, Nipsey. If he's innocent, free him. Um, if he's innocent, free yeah, him. Yeah, I asked y'all if y'all dead or alive. You talking about like right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I, got oh, now, now, that, now. I got some niggas that. I got some niggas that. No, 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 it's kind of hard, bro. I don't hey, know. Like, he ain't right trying to give none of these niggas credit, bro. It's That's crazy. Hard. Nah, you ask. I got, I got more than five. Yeah. So, so look. So okay. So my top five is no order. This is just the top five. Um, I, I, I'll say Wally, 
I'll say Kalen, 03 Greedo, um, four, damn. I don't want to put just all like, in our, all big sad. Um, and then the fifth one will probably be, I'll be real, yo. Like, ever since I heard like an AZ Chikes, um, uh, Verse on a and on, boy. yeah, Ryan School Q shit, bro. I'm a tap into that nigga, bro. I say, yo, bro. You rap like that for years, nigga. For nah, sure. bro. Like that nigga was on some floating shit, bro. He that that nigga was on. Like that for years. Yeah, that nigga really been spazzing for a long time. Bro, he was on, bro. Time, bro. I said, bro, listen. I I say, yo, listen, like, bro, like, there's niggas out here rapping like that. You feel me, right? So yeah, so him. You feel me? Five. Feel me? That's Taj right there, by the way. Oh, you. Come here, rap, man. Come and spit real quick. Come <laughs> rap is crazy. He's oh, fucking. Oh, man, it's crazy, he, he man. He said, cash at me. The man oh, man. niggas to rap is wild. Do he sing or rap? Like, you he rap. rap. That nigga taught me how to rap. Man, bullshit, bro. Hey, he's like younger than you, though. No. Nah. He's, he's, he's like your age? He a little older than me. Really? Some months. Yeah. Wait, hold on. How old are you, Wally? I'm 29. You in your 20s? Yeah, how old you thought I was? Like 33, 34? Oh, that's dope. Good looking. That's crazy. The beard working, baby, because everybody always thought I was like 16. I used to hate that shit. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, two. Okay, also two. Listen, bro, like you've been like, the fuck? <laughs> that shit's scary. Yo, bro, you've been stepping up your swag, right? Like, um, it's... right? Like, yeah. <laughs> no, listen. No, 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 no. Um, because, uh, oh my God, bro. Uh, and it was the, like, what's the UC video? I say, yo, Wally is putting that shit on. You feel me, man? Like, oh yeah, I got a lot of custom shit. Like, did you hire like a new stylist? Like, what happened? Like, cause you actually went from saying, yo, like he's a fly, like he's a fly street nigga, to like, he's just like a fly fashion nigga now. Nah, to be honest, I never really was giving a fuck about like, like I I felt like my music was speaking for itself. Like I didn't really care to get to get dope just yeah for a whole lot of shit. Like I'm a barefoot type nigga. Mm. Like, I don't really be caring about that shit. I'm a, I'm a hood baby. Yeah. But, um, shit. I did switch my style up a little bit, though. But I be wearing mostly custom shit. Okay. Like, most of the shit that I wear, it get made just for me. So, I, I fuck with that. I don't really like wearing the same shit that everybody wear. Even though I do, because all the shit I be wearing, cough syrup, mm -hmm. Bardesto, Asali, Milo, uh -huh. Center Seeking, or Asales. That's, like, the main shit I be wearing. Uh -huh. But that's just like on my free time. <clears throat> Whenever I'm doing a show or something, I wear a custom. Yeah, man. Yo, yo, folks, listen, man. Folks, listen, man. We had a great show. <laughs> Wally, man, thank you, man. Oh, also, too, Wally, bro. Like, so one, when is the um uh so when is you and Greedo tape tape like coming? Um, we gonna drop that shit this summer, hopefully. Wait. As of right now, huh? Wait. Um, and how okay, so like how do okay, so how do like so how do like a joint album work between like an independent artist and somebody in Hussan? Oh um, shit, it can work either way. Like however niggas want to do it. Yeah. Okay. Like, we can drop it through him. I could drop it. Mm -hmm. Whatever the case may be. Ah. Uh. But I was saying, um, as of right now, make sure y'all go check out UC because that shit taking over right now. Everybody, Fire. Everybody fucking with that song. Uh -huh. Guidance. That's a real track. That's a real uh, song. That's Brighter, my shit right there. Brighter Days is a big ass song. It's really a big. Oh, song. oh, oh yeah, yo. Look, right, look, did you fit, like did you like record like with the choir and in the studio with you or did you like just Yeah, we went to the studio and really? recorded that shit. Yeah, shout out to them. I don't remember everybody. Are you independent names. still? Huh? Are you like independent still, right? Yeah, I'm independent. And you hiring like entire choir to Hey, listen, bro. And listen, yo. Like this is listen, man. And that's why he's going to win, right? Cuz this nigga ain't cheap meaning this, right? Listen, bro. As an independent artist, say, yo, bro, I'm finna dig into my pocket, bring a choir, cause yeah. I would, bro, come on, bro. Like, that's some hard yeah, shit right there, my nigga. Ain't shit free, man. This music shit, it's, that's gonna, crazy, take, it's gonna take before it gives. So, I don't be tripping off of it. Like, for my whole career, bro, I really wasn't even worried about money. Like, yeah. now that I'm independent, of course, I'm like putting together a plan uh, of course. to execute on how to really get rich, stay rich, but. Yeah. Like when you doing this shit because you love it, you don't really do it for the money. Oh, um, and like, what's the big like like the big chain at Wally chain at like the that motherfucker just got bust down. I gotta go pick it up. 
<clears throat> wait, 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 uh, wait, uh, what that mean? It, I just got diamonds, diamonds put all over it. <laughs> oh, I thought you said, oh, oh. Oh, my God. Bet. Yeah, I just, I just got that motherfucker flooded. I got to go pick it up out of town. Wait, hold on. Yeah. You put the diamonds on the gold? Yep, it'll be back. Oh, you getting money now, man. Hey, hey man, hey, listen, man, shit. Hey, listen, mm -hmm. man, let me just get my broke ass up out of here, man. Oh, oh, also, too, by the way, listen, after the cameras go off, man, Bro, I'm trying to hear the 03 Flow remix that's that's like coming soon. Oh, yeah, I did tell y'all I was going to play. Yeah. Play. I got you. Folks, the 03 Flow remix, bro, is going to be, bro, listen, I promise you right now, I'm saying it right here, bro, the 03 Flow remix is going to chart. I promise you, I listen, and if it doesn't chart, I will personally give $10,000 to any fan who's trying to bet. Give it to me if it don't chart. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. <nah. laughs> Give mean, it to hey. the Walster, man. <laughs> man. And make sure y'all like, comment, yeah, and subscribe man. if you ain't already subscribed already. This has yes, been sir. another episode of Here We Go Again. Peace out, folks. Facts. No cap. Peace out, man.